So I might be playing Chex Quest HD. Hey Craig, what's up Craig? How you doing? Thanks Resin. You have a good day too. What's up Applesauce? It's not sweeping in. How do I get to the second page? There we go. Okay. Now this game's cool. This game's cool. I like this game. This game's pretty cool. It's like it's like you're a historical a history detective and just like historians are are really boring. They have a really boring job. That's all. You know, so we're just experiencing the life of someone who has a really boring job, but that also gets stabbed. Sometimes it gets stabbed by a smuggler. There we go. Get that scan in there. Shaved his beard for charity. And then he looks like me or something, Saxo? I didn't look at it. I can look at it. Initiating upload. We had to scan this thing into our VR sim. He shaved his beard. Think he looks like me? I'm not sure. Maybe there's some similar features. Or he's eating subs. Are you saying that he shoves, I sub, shoves subs into my face like him? <laughs> we love Suikoden 3. You know, I think, I kind of want to play Suikoden 1 and 2. I've never played 3 through 5. I heard that they can be a little slow in the way that a lot of uh, PS2 games can be. Oh no! That's the murderer! Oh crap! We gotta run! Wait, we, hold on. Oh no! <laughs> this game is Smith. This game's insane. This game's insane. I swear to God, this game is probably for kids. It's a game for it's a game for like young teens or something, where you can get brutally stabbed <laughs> by a smuggler. <laughs> Yo, Prax, smoke. Good morning. What's up, Mahoney? No, we're gonna. I'm gonna force myself to finish, like I always do. I'm gonna come become finish. Oasis is here. Stick around. We got Oasis. <laughs> Hey, Fracking Toasters, afternoon, how's the EU? Yeah, it's a nice setting. No, the setting's great, Ten Elements. Yeah, I love the setting. What's up, Viva? One's alright, two's great. Yeah, three. I've never played three. See, this is what I'm saying with this game. It's like... It's like sometimes it's dry, and then sometimes it has... The main character getting stabbed with by a person. A really, really angry person. <laughs> Because that guy's a smuggler. I think he's trying to stop us from figuring out that he smuggled um, historical objects. <laughs> the game turned into Urban Runner. It's it's got aspects of that are weird, like Urban Runner, but it's not it's not as cool as Urban Runner. But yeah, you have to escape from the yeah escape from the thugs. Yeah, like an Urban Runner, you have to escape from thugs. I sh Tom shoves subs by the seashore. Subway. Ugh, Subway. No, thank you. I do love to eat a good sandwich. Oh, you're talking... Yeah, I love a good sub, Saxo. Yeah, definitely. Love a good sub. Good sandwich. I was thinking about that today, this morning. I don't know why. I was thinking about... The more that's on a sandwich for me, the better it is. Like, you could just put anything you want. Anything on a sandwich. Keep adding stuff, and I'll... I will, I will still eat it. Too far. Are right, we gotta run. I guess I'm supposed to run somewhere? I'm running away from him? Oh no, I'm getting... Wait a second. <laughs> oh wait, that's the dude who's funding the... Wait, is he a murderer too? What? Are you alright? <laughs> Who is that man? You look a little upset. Why don't you come with me? Let me buy you that drink I promised you. Yeah, why does that guy care if that if a uh, bald guy's there? He just he stabbed me in public before. That guy's gonna buy me a drink. And there's a guy standing there with a screwdriver ready to stab me. A little child wearing a plaid coat. What the hell? What's going on there? Hey, good morning, uh, Mandy. How is No Man's Sky? That game looks cool. I, I need to put aside some time to play that. Turn around every now and then I get stabbed by a smuggler. Sherife brought me here when I first met her. Sherife. It's where she comes when she needs to clear her head. She's brought many beautiful things into my life, that woman. Huh? Like what? Magnificent, isn't it? Very magnificent. This city has seen a thousand years of history. It has survived earthquakes and revolutions. And now it's being it in a way by pollution and population and inaction. Oh, man. But still a city of opportunity. 
That is why I work so hard to restore her. Istanbul must remember her better self. But come, tell me, what is troubling you? Yeah, you learn about. I, I am also interested in learning about the Byzantine Empire too. I think I'm. I think I'm a. I'm a preteen in my mind. What FMV games have a weird charm? Something about the acting, the characters. It's like uh, what? they're kind of eerie. Hold on, what happened here? This Craig subbed. Craig, thank you for the sub for 14 months. Thank you, Craig. Uh, and Strange, what's up, man? Strange Blaze, what's up, dude? Thank you for the raid. How's how you doing today? What's going on? Oh my god, hold on. A million things are happening right now. Okay, I did not do that right. Um, Strange, what's up, man? Thank you for the raid. I appreciate that. The Strange, a great streamer. You guys should check out Strange. What's he doing? Let me see. Let me see if it shows me anymore. Twitch's Twitch website's weird now. Um, Chrono Trigger. Oh, cool. Chrono Trigger. Excellent. Have you played Chrono Trigger? Have you played that before? Chrono Trigger is one of the best games ever, man. Hey, James, what's up? Uh, we're playing. Uh, we're playing a weird FMV game where you're. It's like a learning game where you get. You can also be stabbed. We got bludgeoned. We got bludgeoned by uh by like a one of those police batons. Murdered. Um. Very shifty eye, yeah, shifty eyes, shifty cam. The cam work is good in this front. Hey, the A2, what's going on? Deviant Fish. New update is nice and spooky. Okay, I'll try it. Okay, Madagon, thanks for the gift sub. Yo, yo, thank you so much, Madagon, for another gift sub. Enjoy that, Deviant Fish. And you guys should all check out The Strange for sure. Yeah, The Strange. I know you, you tend to be tired when you raid. Like, you got to go. So it's all good, man. It's all good. I appreciate that raid. Thank you. You guys should follow the strange for sure. Do 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 do. You don't hear real accents that thick. A lot of the times, yeah, you don't. Yeah, that's true. Uh, I think Sharif's project maybe. So what's going on in this game is that um, it's kind of weird. There's this lady's making a VR project that like pulls in information from the internet to like recreate historical buildings. And then they recreated this building where there was this treasure. And apparently these smugglers had like snuck in there and took objects out of it. And they don't want people to find out that there's these secret passages or something. Because then they'll get caught. I don't know. It's something like that. It's kind of weird. It's a weird story. Oh, what's up, Terry? You only know Byzantine from Civ 2. All right, all right, Mace on Nicholas. Hello. Okay, so Sharif's project is that VR project, and then you had a friend. Your friend was like, your friend was hacking into this VR project or adding to it, and then he got murdered. We don't really know why my friend got murdered yet. The police think I'm a suspect in M Ray's death. That's your dead friend. Sharif made the VR project. The man who killed M Ray's trying to kill me. There's a detective Akalin with the police. He's harassing me. Huh? These are like different ideas. The man who killed M Ray's trying to kill me. You saw his killer? Can you describe this man? Was it the man that was following you earlier? And this guy is funding the VR project. Yes, and I know where he works. A Nargyle bar in the Divan Yolo, Yolo is district. I wouldn't be surprised if this guy's part of the smuggling ring, though. Yes, he's part... I can say, yes, he, this wasn't the only time he tried to attack me. I'm not sure. I have, but the police won't take it seriously. Yes, I know where he works. The bar. I know that area. It's very dangerous. Yeah, sure is. Leave Jump this cut. work to the police. That's what they're paid for. All right, just do nothing. Well, Why don't you stop by the hotel for my award ceremony? Okay. I will be honored to have you as my guest. Oh, I'll come by. Oh, yeah, sure. The guy's trying to murder me. I'll just come by your hotel to watch you get an award. Sure. That's a good idea. That sounds like good fun. Plus, the strange note called me handsome. Everyone. You, you guys should take the uh, example from the strange call me handsome more often I want to be called handsome more often by chat or else I'm randomly banning one person per hour new no, no man sky update looks good I haven't played it since it came out literally like the day it came out all right I gotta go all oh, right this game constantly makes you confused about where you need to go Oh, we took a picture. Oh, now we have to upload it to the VR. In Istanbul? Or has it been uploaded? And the They told me you were checking out for Emre. 
<laughs> they know everything. You have to stop. This is the Emre's brother. Or uncle, no uncle, uncle. You have something they want? They know this too. They kill him for this, they will kill me too, you understand? It means mm. nothing for them. So please, whatever it is they want, give it to them. You are looking for a villain? I am the villain. Emre's blood is on my head. I guess that's <laughs> okay. Zia, go out, walks out the side left of the screen. I guess that's Gemray's uncle, and um, he had gambling debts, and Emray was trying to do stuff to make money to repay the gambling debts. Yeah, thanks again, Craig Madigan, for those subs today. Thank you. Do 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 do. do. You're hungry. What do you want, front? Guess what I had this morning for breakfast? You'll never be able to guess. Oatmeal. That's right. I don't know why I can eat that every day. Every stream day. Okay, we can look at these shelves here. This is where the girl was making the VR sim, but she's not here anymore. I think because people are trying to kill her too now. So now we can explore her office. Sharif, I have... I can't read this. Sharif, I have sent Cleo's... Log in records to the police as you suggested. The you aware that are you aware that Emre's journalist friend has been using your Instagram for several months, your program for several months. I haven't been using the program for several months. That's a lie. Let's hope the authorities can settle this matter once and for all. Wait, is that a lie? Is someone trying to there's like this weird kind of complex story going on here sci-fi-esque story and also the worst acting I've ever seen in my life it's an interesting combination a fine chiseled man thank you ooh phone ringing we gotta find the phone where is it oh god oh, damn went to one ring oh that's a modem oh, never mind that's a modem be like yeah everyone be like strange you need to be called handsome more or footsome yeah Footsome's fine, too. Grant proposal for Project Cleo. That's the VR thing, Project Cleo. Digital Grant Recreation. Clebby, th oh my god, a tier two sub. Clebby with a, a tier two sub. Thank you, Clebby. Thank you very much for a tier two sub. Thanks for supporting the stream. Appreciate that so much. Thank you. It's a whole different game. X, yeah. Very good. Yeah, I want to play it. It's just I gotta knock, I gotta block out some time for it. No Man's Sky, Deviant. Hey, Vail Dan. Hey, Totinos, ugh, yuck. Why 80s and 90s tech is the grayish cream color? That's true. It was all that cream. It, it might have had something to do with like, that's that was like the cheapest way to manufacture that material. A lot of it has to do with that, from what I know. That I'm continuing it. Yeah, we're trying to beat it today, casual meme. Uh, grant application... Right, this just tells you about Cleo. Maybe you could have even looked at this before and I just didn't realize. This just tells us about how the VR recreates historical sites by... And sometimes it can, like, create things people don't know about. This is exciting. Look at this exciting room we're in. It was probably just all about, like, that was the cheapest plastic type, type to manufacture. I'm gonna guess. I don't know. That's a modem, man. That is a modem. That is a modem. Alright, so I think we go into VR now? Since... Or do I need to upload it? Deviant Fish Redeemed Retrobrag. The Retrobrag of the day is this game. I never played this. Hold on, we're going in! Alright, we're in. The Retrobrag of the day is... Basilica Cistern. 532 Be quiet. AD. This Final weird ass game. Page. Zed is Servant of Sheol. I, I never played this. I need to try to get this game to work. Zed as Servant of Sheol. Look, an interactive adventure game. This game looks weird. And there's like three of these games apparently. Look at this weird lady. We should play this. Sorry, that's a really bad reflection. This game looks weird. Whoops. <laughs> that's your retro brag. Is, is that okay? Thanks again, Clubby. No man, Sky is cool. Craig, play that too. What's up, Nathan? Hey, guy from Red Bank. 
light cream and got darker. So let's see if we can go through now that we've, uh, you want to scan, you, we need to scan things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, it's transferred in here. Before we had to get the lady to transfer it into the VR for us. All right, enough. But now, uh, wait, hold on. Need to go back. Need to go the other way. Come visit your space metropolis. Well, I would play it on computer. Right, can I visit it if uh, I'm on computer, Mandy? Hey, Bitterman, what's up, man? Yeah, there was no nudity there. Creamy grayish plastic. It was pretty strong. Yeah, alpacaish. Hey, alpacaish. Never seen it. It's ZS Servant of Shield. Then there's like two more games. I don't. I don't know if they're they've been released in the U.S. I'll try it. I think I tried to load it up a few years ago when I wasn't as good as making games work. Okay, I have to use this. No, I don't use this here. Oh, that we didn't get what we need. We need to get something else to uh, go further. Unless it's a hotspot thing. Oh no, we need to get different columns. No, oh, no. We need to find things in the real world to scan to finish the things, um... Simulate the, the ability for it to simulate. I might also have to just go watch that guy's award ceremony. Let's go back here. Oh, you gotta save too, because you can die. You can die. 18. Columns. I don't know why it gets all chunky when I'm trying to save the game. VR intro sequence, yeah, it's pretty cool. Doom, 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 doom. It's a pretty well made game. Probably could have been more exciting, but it's a pretty cool game anyway. Interesting, educational, focused adventure game. I don't think there's anything else to do here. I can go over here. A bunch of bi bags. Bunch of bags. Uh, the ground. Am I supposed to scan the ground? You're making me look at the ground. Okay. Um, why is it letting me look at all this stuff? I wonder if you can. If you're supposed to go this way instead. Maybe if you go this way instead, you get killed. It's a dead end. There's nothing here. This is weird. Weird. Alright, let's go travel to, um... Where'd he say to go? The re the award ceremony. Where, where'd he say to go? He took us to Galata Tower. Yeah, someone was trying to frame us. That's what we learned in the university. Someone was trying to frame us for accessing the uh, database. But it wasn't us. Alright, we do need to go in here. Never seen this game, Maceron. Neither had I. Neither have I. Looks like a PS1 fighting game. It does have that kind of feel. Or you never seen Zeta. Sorry, I'm like reading chat like Basilica weird Cistern, today. Basilica Cistern, 532 AD. Final oh. construction phase. I'm reading chat weird today. It has crossplay. Oh, it does. That's cool, Mandy. That's cool. All right, where do I? Where's the column I'm trying to get to? In here, we got to use the. Uh, we got to use the image of the column in here somewhere. Hold on, let me let me let me see what it says to do. Go to the left, straight, and then right. Okay, there's I gotta use it somewhere else. Go to the left, that's left. Let me read this here. Only the first game is English? Right, right, right. You know about that game of cause? Zedas? Have you played Zedas? <laughs> VR Troopers. <laughs> I was singing that song, the VR Trooper song, the other day. We are VR. I hope Dave comes today so we can watch the him being scared clip. We uh we uh looks like Fighting Force. It's made by a Japanese dev. Okay. Hey, Danny Morris. Uh. Oh, there's where we need to put it. Damn. 
extrapolating, extrapolating, extrapolating. <laughs> oh, something I entered the court of a Muslim house, descended by the light of a torch, a steep and damp staircase, mm. and found myself under the vault of Yerabatan Sarai, the great cistern basilica. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, I don't feel like learning today. Thanks. Thank you. PSV. But if we are to create springs mm. from which the water supplies come, we mm. must dig wells. In digging wells, we must not make light of science. The methods of nature must be considered closely in the light. Uh-huh. Yeah. No, 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 thank you. Hey, Core. What's up, Core? FPS shootout? This would be a good, like, FPS. It's like a golden eye... Golden eye, uh, deathmatch level. Hey, Feli, thanks for the host. Extrapolating. 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 It's like... If you have that interface, someone had to put, put that in there. Which is completely excessive. Have a 3D rotating letters <laughs> telling you what the program's doing. Engineering frame? What am I supposed to do in here? Okay, I got an engineering frame. My god, this is... This area is horrifying. It's all just... It all looks the same. All looks the damn same. Shame. Hopefully there's only one path through here. Mm-hmm. Maybe 1980 or 1990 VR headsets, yeah. Are there puzzles? Yeah, there are a lot of puzzles. Uh, the VR area was all, is all... The, the last VR area was all puzzles. Um, there's puzzles in the real world area too. Yeah, there's puzzles. There are definitely some puzzles. There's been a bunch of puzzles. I'd say a fair amount. Good amount. Teardrop motif. Okay, I'm just making sure that we don't miss anything. All right, we keep going forward. We got get these items. There's still probably there probably will be a puzzle soon. Hey, hospags, can I provide a guided tour? The game is doing that for us. Those are explorers that had seen the basilica, I guess, or that were building it. Talking. I'm like less polating. Uh, I know what you mean. I implement. Oh, geez. So this is what I'm talking about. All right. Now we got an implement. Oh, and another engineering frame. This is like a hidden object game in here. I'm trying to make sure we get all these things. Oh, wait. That's the thing. Okay. Oh, my God. I barely saw that. Okay. Hopefully we got all the objects and we don't have to walk through here looking for objects again. Har horrifying. Pillies are the pillars of eternity. You're still st stuck in here for eternity. Hey, Joe. Thanks for the prime sub. How you doing, Joe? Thank you very much. Thank you very much for that prime, primed sub. Another thing. Another thing. Oh, my God. We're going to build something. We're going to build something. Wandering about in the office. Oh, I didn't think about that. About how you move in this VR sim. It's probably walking around. Oh, damn. Another thing. Oh, God. There's too many items. We're just walking about <laughs> wherever we are, just knocking things over. Yeah. He's about to walk to the top of that tower and jump off the edge. Oh, man. We're definitely going to miss an item. I tried my best. Hopefully, we won't. Hey, Mick Blue. Yeah, thanks, Joe. You're not trash anymore. Oh, what are you now? What's six months, Badge? I forget. One month is trash can. Two month recycling. That's three month recycling bin. Oh, we're back at the beginning. Uh, okay. We're back at the beginning. And we got all these items. Okay. So now do I... Now what do I do? I forget what six months is. Can you talk, Joe? So we can see what the badge is. Oh, six months, I think, is a computer chip. No, yeah, it is. And then nine months is the CD drive. Yeah. And then 12 months is the computer. Computer system. Oh, more things. What is going on? We're, build, we're building something. We're going to build something here. You like hidden object games? I generally like them, but a lot of them tend to put like a really annoying story in that is really annoying to navigate when you kind of just want to I, I just want to do hidden object games like don't have it's like those it's like certain um like Poyo Poyo Tetris has this really stupid story attached with 
playing the adventure mode when I'd, I'd rather just like play all the challenges and stuff it's like that it's annoying when games do that you have nature tool what's up yay carrots anime thank you for that thank you for that you're a chip yeah chip hey otter pop all right um okay all right we've got a bunch of items do i need to, i don't think you combine them in your inventory but i don't i don't see any place to put them skip i can't skip 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 uh, is there a place to like, do I put these somewhere, man? Do I put them on the ramp? Do I put them on the workman's ramp? Do I go up the ramp? Where are you supposed to go? Doom, 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 doom. Doom, doom, doom. Okay, All right, let's go back around. Let's go look around some more. Let's look around some more. Byzantine, the betrayal. Who betrayed who? We will find out. We will find out who betrayed who. Down, 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 down. Let's go around. Go through these pillars. Exciting. This is a cistern. This is something they use to transport water. It's like their water system or something like that. I'm not exactly sure, to be honest. I think it's where... Yeah, there's a bunch. There was a bunch of water here at some point in time. And it's like a, but why is why is it all these pillars? It's did they like did they fill this place up with water? Teardrop motif. Okay, am I supposed to use uh this too? Okay, am I supposed to do something on this pillar? It says teardrop motif. Okay, it doesn't say to do anything on it. Wonderful. This is wonderful. This is a wonderful game. This is a very wonderful game. Okay. We're in VR right now. This is VR, by the way. Oh, hold on. Did we go that way? Yeah, that's the only way to go. Okay. Well, I guess we continue. Hold on. I'm just looking up what to do. You... Go to the dead end we visited when we first arrived. Pick up the wooden wheel. Return all the way back to the tier column. Continue forward to a wall. Turn around and pick up a framework. Wait, I missed another one? No, I got I got all those. Yeah. I, I Wait, what's this? Oh, that makes me move. Oops. You can turn back around. Okay, I think I got that framework. This is the wall, right? The teardrop. Turn around. Uh... Turn your back to face the wall. Turn to your left and proceed ahead. Here? What? I can't go that way. Your back to face a wall? You mean this way? Once you stop, turn around and click on the floor in front of the deuce ahead. There's tiles. Hold on, let me go back. Seems hard to figure out. The teardrop column. Continue forward to a wall. Yeah. Turn around and pick up a square-shaped framework. Face your back to the wall. That's what I did. But you can't you can't go to the left, you damn game. You damn walkthrough. Is this the tier column you're talking about? Is this the tier column I'm talking about? There are some cool-looking cisterns. This one has a lot of columns in it, man. Did you notice the columns? Well, I'm guessing they mean the only way, other way you can go. You can go back where we came from. Let me look up and down and stuff. Hold on a second. I saw it was like it looked like the whole thing was lit up like we moved for a second. Nope. All right, this is the only way you can go. So I'm assuming you go this way. I I think we saw the Medusa head, right? What's what's one of the cool looking cisterns? Oh, here we go, Medusa head. Okay, ah, I mean, can, we gotta mess with these tiles here. We gotta do something with these tiles here. Gotta pry them up. Was this a puzz puzz? Okay. Whoops, what happened? Oh, oh, okay. Stop. I was trying to click on that thing. <laughs> what is the way to play that music? I get myself into these situations. Okay, a bunch of holes in the ground. No! Stop that. Stop that. Okay. 
Medusa head mechanism. Bronze, six inch. Okay, there's a Medusa head mechanism. Oh, I have to figure out what to do with this. Okay, put these moons on it. Put these boards on it. Put this board on it. Put this engineering framework on it. What? What? Oh, the music started playing really strangely. Put this in it. This. Uh, click on it. Move it. Hmm. I don't have anything to put in it. I don't have anything to put in it. I have to put something in these holes. Put put this wood. These wood in this holes. This wood in this holes. Put. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Take a poop on it. Hmm. Take a poop on it. Maybe Joe. Hmm. Put a poop on it. Hmm. So okay, I have an idea. Maybe we need to back out and put some other things in these holes. Let's see the framework. Okay, here we go. Oh no, we need another framework. Wait. Oh, okay. No, no, no. We're good. We're good. Hopefully we got all the pieces. This looks like it goes here. No. This looks like it goes... Alright, what do we got? A wheel? Oh, we gotta lift the... Oh, we have to lift the columns. Right, there was a clue about that. I don't put this in between those holes. That looks like... Something with the rope. Rope, 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 rope. But what do I even have? I don't have anything else. I only have these things, so... I might have missed something. I may have missed one of these items. Oh wait, no, no, wait, it lit up. Okay, this this game is the worst with hotspots. It also seems like sometimes you you mouse over a thing and it like skips the hotspot. Okay, the wheel. So it makes the hotspots like very, very hard to find. This game does two cardinal sins of adventure gaming. It makes hotspots unnecessarily hard to find and it makes you wander around random locations without any knowledge of where you're supposed to go and it also makes you learn three cardinal sins forces you to learn okay well well we got the rectangular shaped engineering frame we got the angled engineering frame we got the engineering support these here engineering supports we got this moon hole but i've got this board this this pole and i've got is this a rope maybe i need to look at it yeah that's a rope and tackle we got a rope and tackle you, you think you'd place that last right and we got a rod we got a rod and we got a wheel wouldn't you think that rod goes here in between the, the two holes? Put the wooden rod on top of the two supports already in place. How? How? I can't. It doesn't let me. I'm trying. Place one of the supports in the back part of the double side sole. Okay, we placed all that. Put the wooden rod on top of the two supports already in place. How? Where? How? What else are you supposed to do? Put the wheel on the portion. Um, like the ropes. Oh man, I don't know, man. I don't know, man. We have to go look for more pieces. This game makes me depressed. Uh, okay, just kidding. Wait, I can take things up. Oh, you can pick things back up again. Oh, maybe you need to... Wait, you can... Oh, did I put them in the wrong place? Did I put something in the wrong place? Oh, you can pick them back up. Hmm. Oh, you can put different things oh this looks wait maybe this is wrong okay i see it's not okay so i actually have to use my brain okay let's try that there because this looked weird okay that doesn't look right oh it didn't it was farted at me and fell apart okay i did not like that <laughs> okay all right let's try this again then okay you would think that this this and then this weird one here goes here I put this here and then put the rod in I think um 
Let me take these out. Uh, well, hey, Ranscott. I hear that thing groan. Can I put the, wouldn't you think the rod goes there? Does the rod doesn't go there? The wheel, wheel through the rod, rod. And this is like a singular thing. Or maybe it's like, no, that's not right. Hold on. I didn't try putting anything back here. Okay, something is wrong. Like the, maybe this goes back here. Wait, was this a weird shadow? Oh, why does it have a weird shadow like that? Okay, that doesn't look right. It like places the shadow. So you can tell it's wrong because it's placing the shadow like completely incorrectly. Why is it placing that weird shadow there, man? <laughs> I think you have to... <laughs> I think this is right. You'd think it would be like this. Why is it that that weird shadow there, man? Oh, that went all the way down in there. Oh, no, it's like hidden. All right, this is... This is... Okay, maybe... Uh, No, the wheel goes... Yeah, hold on. The wheel, it would make sense if the wheel goes here, wouldn't it? The wheel goes in the front, maybe, or and like the rod and tackle goes down here. <laughs> and uh, I think kind of makes sense. I had it where I had it. I think we might have to save because we can look up, resume. And then um, exit the system. It's locked. I think we had learning uh, a VR pizza. Mm. Mm -hmm. I think uh, there's a picture in his apartment on what it is. Can you combine stuff? No. Hey, Tony Mars. Yeah, we're making a winch. I don't know exact. I, I didn't have the things placed correctly. Yeah, that shadow was weird. I think there's a picture of it in his apartment. There's like a book. There's a book that has a picture of the device. Actually using brain, yeah, no good. No good. Engineering, Roman engineering. Here it is. Okay. So we got the thing in the back. That This guy's going in the front, and this goes in the back, and in the middle, and then you got the wheel. We might not have all the pieces. I'll take a picture of this. This is a Roman hoist, son. That's a Roman hoist, son. You know what I know is a Roman hoist? Iron forceps? Let me take a picture of these instructions, too. Love this game, baby. Hey, Sherbzar, good morning. What's up, Chris Synth? When we was on the bus. We was on the bus, go up and down. Yeah, yeah, I think it goes like this, and I think this goes here. Okay, and the wheel or the rod goes here, right? The rod goes here, right? Maybe you have to have the other pieces up first. So this definitely goes here. This definitely goes here, but the shadow is throwing me off. The weird shadow. Is that a bug? We might not have all the pieces. All right, we're going to leave. We got to make sure we have all the pieces. Ugh, got to seek and find for all the pieces. Seek and... Seek and find. Luckily, we can skip the animations. Hey, Tonda. Parch goes day. The clam goes day. We'll just look down at the ground. It's fine. Not a problem. Looks like a cistern in Istanbul. Yeah, it is. It is a cistern in Istanbul, Shervzar. That's where we are. It's the Balisk... Uh, what is it called? Balisk Cistern. Something like that. Yep, that's what it is. Mm-hmm. An inverted Medusa head. It is, yeah. Medusa head, too. It's a Medusa head. It definitely is. Yeah, we've been... Unfortunately, we've been learning. Uh, as we've been playing the game. It's been forcing us to learn. Tiny little shrimps go everywhere. What's that from? Is that like a rhyme? Uh, okay, going this way. There's a dead end before. Not a dead end anymore. And we're looking for little items to pick up. Oh, here's a thing. Implement. Okay, what's this? 
This is... Okay. I don't know what that is. Okay, but we got another piece. We have to go look for more pieces. Good. I like, I like exploring. I like it. Roman hoist sounds like a sandwich. I would eat that. I love sandwiches. Like a sick loot in his house. Sick loot. Now it's Istanbul. Mm hmm. Or something like that. Yeah. Um. I it's Istanbul now. Right. And yeah, we're still looking for pieces. Maybe maybe this was the piece we needed. Maybe we're done. Gong gong. Man, making you look for pieces. That's messed up. That's wrong. Let's go around the side here. Ladder in the back. Shadow is a mind trick. Mind freak. Oh, Parappa. Oh, it's from Parappa. Which one? One or two? I've only ever played some of one. And we're looking for items, objects. <laughs> the other day I was called a giant turkey. I'm a chicken got it, you beef jerky. It's a good game. It's a good, good game. Okay, we'll keep looking. We'll keep looking around. Okay, you can... Uh, can you go another way? Is there an item? Is this an item? Or is it only... You can only go... Well, you can only go this way, and then there's no way to go from here. I thought I went around in a circle last time. This is just a dead end. Northwest corner. You can go back. Do the puzz. All right, maybe we can do more puzz now that we got this piece. Puzz piece. <sighs> Okay, we got that goes there for sure. Um, I don't know if like this goes over there and then these two go here. I'm not sure, man. Because the wheel goes here. But wouldn't you think like the crank is over here? This seems like it's for the crank. Doesn't it? And this goes here and then maybe these go in but this goes in between? No? Uh, this goes here. Oh, no, this is probably the, the crank. No? And then, I th I'm pretty sure this... Oh, there we go. The shadow's not all screwed up anymore. Stupid shadow. Alright. Let me put the bar in here. Let me put the wheel in here. Let me get the wheel in there. Let me put this thing in here. Can't put anything else in... Oh, rope. Okay. We got the rope. Okay. Rope in, rope, rope on, wheel in, wheel on, in on. I feel like I'm missing an item. I feel like I'm missing something because I can't seem to put this in here. Can't put this in here. Can't put this in here. Wait, wait, no. Can't put this in. Oh, maybe you have to put this in here. Yeah, here we go. Oh, oh, oh. Do you think I, I wonder if I need... Oh. I can turn these with this. Hmm. Uh. I turn. How did I do that? I can turn these. But to what degree do you need to turn them? Mystery. Mystery. Mystery, mystery. Let me look, see, make sure we found all the items. Ropes and forceps. Okay, let's go. Let's go. We definitely missed an item, I feel. So let's get out of here. Can we put it on the phone in Urban Runner? We got to call the guys on two different phones and put the receivers together. <laughs> That's an amazing puzzle. It's genius is what it is. To me, to me, it's genius, Macaw. What do you think about it? Yeah, you put the receivers. I vaguely remember that puzzle. <laughs> it's just, that's... It's maybe the most genius phone puzzle of all time. He cashed. Hey, Agrimar. <sighs> okay, so we've got to look around. We possibly missed an item. Possibly missed an item. And we need to find. 
And we're going to find it. <laughs> I remember Urban Runner being pretty cool. What about the puzzle where you like kick a ball? <laughs> like the puzzle, the solution is like, you're like a thug is going to murder you. And the solution is kick a rubber ball at his head. <laughs> I mean, the whole game's ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> what about the hairdos in that game everything absolutely everything about that game is 100% ridiculous there was like shaved head with a long braid down to the person's butt otherwise shaved head the game's completely insane someone gets punched in their jean jacket do I still have I've got that gif somewhere I'm gonna we need oh no I just changed the size of the window I, uh, we got to find the punching in the jean jacket gif. If I search for jean on my computer, it'll probably come up. Jean. We need to find this gif right now. Jean. Samo jean? What is that? Game art. Huh? <laughs> Why do I have that? Why do I have that? <laughs> From when we played that game. Uh, dang, it's not here. Is it under urban? Well, I have it on my computer under urban. Urban? I'm gonna, like accidentally make something appear that I don't want to. <laughs> Somehow, I don't know. Urban. Urban punch. Wait, I found it. Urban punch. Here we go. Urban glasses guy. Oh, that guy. Urban runner. Yeah, here you go. Whatever. Whoa, where'd this music come from? This part is the best part. Oh no, I'm screwing. The stream is a mess today. This part? <laughs> ah! Ah! He gets punched right in his jean jacket by the dude with the long braid and the shaved sides of his head. <laughs> this is the best part of Urban Runner. The game is crazy. We, we need more games like this. Gets He just gets punched right in his jean jacket. Dude wearing a flame sweatshirt. Flames on the arm of his sweatshirt. Yeah, that's my favorite scene in Urban Runner. Alright, where I got lost. Where are we going? <laughs> Everyone remembers that scene. Oh man. Oh wait, I just noticed there's a compass here. I think I've been complaining that there's no compass multiple times. You can pick up the scrunched up paper and throw it. Yeah, there's also like failures things. Yeah, there you can also do the wrong things and get and like fail. Which I like in Urban Runner too. I think there's even something else you can do to that to that guy. I might have to give up. I'm gonna have to give up. I can't figure this out. <laughs> okay. Um, I think I need to get forceps I don't have. The back between the two engineering supports. Enter the engineering support with a full circle. Cut. We got rectangular engineering frame. We got angle engineering frame. We got engineering support with a full circle. We got engineering support. We got wooden rod. We got wheel. We got the remaining support. And then is this forceps? What is this? We need forceps. Is that the, this isn't forceps. This is like a handle. We need to get forceps. Wait. Forceps and rope is the rope. Okay, so wait, I think we have everything. I think we have everything. No, don't quit without saving. <laughs> no, never quit without saving. Never. And they find my entity. <laughs> Guy got punched right in his jean jacket. Yeah, and the flame sleeves too. Everything is everything is amazing in that video. So you go this way. We go this way. We go the this way. As long as I came, I say, I had to get back to the Medusa. I'll just load. No, because I haven't saved after I had the, uh, 
handle. You go. This way. We're back at the beginning. Great job. I go straight. And then I go. Straight. And then that's turning around. Straight. This is a dead end. Okay. This, this, let make sure this is a rope and forceps, right? Ro rope and tackle. I'm guessing they mean rope and forceps. Rope and tackle is the same as rope and forceps. <laughs> Flames make his arm go faster, exactly, or makes it look like it's coming at you faster. Get a lot more scared. Welcome to Sleepy Saturday, Retrograde Tom channel. Play games that'll put you back to sleep. You have a hard time sleeping Friday? You're up all night partying? Sleepy Saturday. We always play games that uh, make you snooze. Sleepy Saturday. <laughs> Um, what? Okay, here we go. All right, back at the pillar. Back at the pillar. And then, okay, we have all the pieces we need. I just have to do it correctly. Let me look at the picture, see if I can figure it out. Look at the damn picture. And the instructions. The tube bream jib is braced and fixed in an inverted V position. Let, let, uh, together at the top with an iron bracket. Yeah. An iron bracket. The rope is attached at one end to a pulley from which the iron forceps. That's forceps, I guess. What's a forcep? Are suspended. Sure. The other end runs through the upper block at the top of the jib between the jib legs to a windlass. Powered by a treadmill. I don't know what that means. <laughs> Look at the picture. Okay, maybe the hole goes here. All right. Wait. Oh, the wheel goes in between these. Oh, I'm the worst. No, hold on. I'm actually the absolute worst. Okay. And the wheel goes. Wait, I don't know. Wait, no. I feel like I almost had it. Oh, I feel like I'm so close. Okay, maybe you need to put the wheel up there first and then put. The wheel don't the wheel don't go there. And then the hole goes through the wheel, through the wheel. The hole goes through the wheel. This is right though, because it lets you put this here. I think this is right. Hard to find items. Yeah, no, I, but I think we found them all. I think we found all the items. Do I need to take the forceps out? I don't, I don't know. Definitely this game isn't like the most perfectly designed game. I think if, if it was designed a little better, it would be a little easier to figure out. Yo, Beard. I'm terrific. Even Sherlock Holmes would agree it's no mystery. I'm terrific. Thanks, Beard. Thanks for the nice words. Are you buttering me up for something? Do you want something? What do you want, Beard? What do you want? Huh? Today we're going to talk about dinosaurs. All right, I'm just going to look it up because I'm done. I'm done with this. <laughs> Put the wooden rod on top of the two supports in place. Place the wheel on the portion of the rod sticking out. All right, maybe do it like this. Hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm still... It's still not right. Maybe you put this in here. Like that. Like this? But it doesn't let you put the rod in now. Which makes me feel like... um. It was right before because it let me put the rod in, but how do I get the wheel in there, chat? Do you put this? This is the hardest puzzle I've ever done in my life. Can you combine stuff? No. No, you can't. No, you, you, you can I or can you? You can't, you're not playing. I can't either because I'm. you can't do that in this game. This is correct. Oh, maybe you have to do it like this. Then put the wheel in. Then... It says to put the wheel after you put the rod. Oh, like this? And then put the wheel in? You do it in order of operations. Hey, Aunt Mickey. Triceps? Biceps? Triceps? Forceps? Five steps. Is this one of the educational parts? I think it kind of is, yeah. Alright. Now... We did it. We did it. We got it all together. First try, too. Nice. Cool. But I don't want to accidentally touch this. Let's save. 
I think this is trying to teach you how things are built. Yeah. I'm not stumped. No, it's just solved it. It's not stumped. Not not stumped at all. So you want to position these based on that poem in your uh, in your inventory, I think. So let's try to figure it out. But we're beating this game today, by the way. Let's get out of the VR. Apesh, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm completely fine. Everything is fine. We gotta look at that poem in our inventory about how to put the heads. Everything is completely fine. In a brick tomb, twin girls sleep with their eyes open. One on her chin, one on her cheek. Okay, one on her chin and one on her cheek. Right. Now they rise. One on her chin, one on her cheek. Well, I kind of already knew that. Chin and cheek. Okay, but from what angle? That's the problem. From what angle? One on her chin, one on her cheek. Not stumped. Hey, Pesh. Basically, Mensa. Is this safe? Dave's VR? <laughs> Dave, is, Dave probably won't come to the stream for a while. Because he's scared that I'm going to play this clip again. <laughs> Beard, have you heard the slow motion version of the clip? <laughs> this is the greatest thing I have. I'm not, this isn't even, I'm not even exaggerating. This is a clip of a streamer called Natural Dave playing VR. And we slowed it down. I can't pick it up. We slowed it down so you could hear every, every moment. <laughs> Have you heard the slowed down version, Beard? <laughs> Can't pick it up. That's a person getting scared in VR. Genuinely getting scared in VR. <laughs> oh, man. Not as funny as it was yesterday, but still funny. <laughs> Can we just listen to it at 0.25 speed, <laughs> real quick? Can't pick it up. <laughs> I think the 0.25 speed really gets me real good. <laughs> Lars, it's a cool game. It's hard. Damn it! It all came apart. What? It all came apart, man. Was it not right? One on her chin, one on her cheek. Okay, that's her cheek. How do I know which one where? The one on her chin? Like that? Wait, it took it apart. I don't think I was done. I don't think I actually finished this the thing. Did I miss an item? Let me out of here. It's okay, we can put it back together easily. <laughs> Poor Dave. Yeah, if it gets less funny, we'll just make it even slower. 0 0.1, 0 0.15 speed. And then 0 0.1 speed. And keep going, keep it going, keep it going. Okay. This makes sense. Wait a second. What did I do? This one over there. Do I even have all the right pieces to this? <sighs> Place them above the hole in the ground. Oh, you're supposed to click the ropes. Oh, okay, that's my bad. Yeah, you can't put the wheel in. I mean, you probably, you could, you could, the thing is, you could put the wheel in between those two pieces, right? And then shove the rod through. Okay, now you're supposed to click on something. Uh, I was like, hand kill. It's a real human genuinely getting scared in VR. <sighs> okay, rectangular shape frame. That's that. Angled frame. That's that. Engineering support with full circle cut out at the back. That's that. Engineering support half circle. Got it. That's that. Wooden rod. Got it. Wheel on the rod. Got it. Remaining support there. Got it. Grab the ropes and click on the center... I don't have the forceps. I don't have these forceps. I don't have the forceps. I need to go get these forceps. Sorry for yelling. I need to get these forceps. We need to get forceps. 
or at least one seps then when neo goes in the rabbit hole <laughs> yeah we live in this puzzle this street this, this is, we're gonna have to delete the we live in this game now we could have played mysteries as a sith today the but i for i'm forcing you guys to learn all right we don't have forceps right are these forceps these better not be forceps Imp these are not forceps forceps are like a clamp they're a clamp. Hmm, music. I'm not. I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up. There are a number of lighter colored tiles that might be open. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, forceps. 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 I could have sworn we walked around in a circle. It says like the forceps. Is this them? Oh, that's making me move. There's like something there on the ground. I, I need a I need something that grabs onto forceps. Okay, teardrop. Well, if we can't find it, then we won't give up. I won't give up. Iron implement, three wooden supports, forceps. Continue to the simulation starting point. Pick up the ropes and forceps. Oh, that's at the starting point. The simulation starting point. Oh. That's where the forceps are? Oh, that would be nice. That would make it pretty easy. That would make it pretty damn easy. The part after the scare, you can tell he's hunched over <laughs> trying to catch his breath. <laughs> it's just... It's, like, <laughs> it's VR. It's like... um, I think VR has the potential to be even more scary than real like real life because you can't get away. Like, you can't... Clo you, you know, like, you're... Everything is... Sh God damn it. This was here this whole time? Do you guys see this? Do you guys see these here? Do I have to ban a random person from chat? You can't like... You can rip, you can rip it off your face, but not really. So, so it has potential to be more scary. Did you guys see this the whole time? Chat? Alright. That's okay. You know what? Crap happens. Crap happens, man. No poo happens. I need the foresight. Maybe I just needed the foresight first. I needed to be I needed to be looking for the forceps. My mind wasn't open enough to find the forceps. Forceps clamp outwards? I don't know, bro. I don't know. That's what this game this game calls them forceps. We didn't have the forceps. We didn't even have any seps, much less forceps. Okay, now we got all the seps. I don't know how to build this in case I ever need to lift something up. Now I know how to build build stuff like this. I'm good, at, I'm good at this kind of thing now. Shivzar, thank you for the gift sub. Uh, enjoy that, Cashed. You might be the random person banned. I, I can't, I can't uh, guarantee either way. Okay, here we go. Uh, but now we need one in her cheek, cheek and one in her face. Okay. It, so that's one on her cheek, one on her chin. Like that? How do I decide which one? Thank you, Shirzar. Thank you very much for the gift subscription. Okay, that doesn't work. So let me try. Um, one on her cheek, one on her chin. You mean like that? Okay, there we go. Okay, 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 okay. All right, easy. Got it. I right, lifted it up. Now we can forcep it. Forcep it down. Why are we doing this though? We're gonna find another treasure, I think. Another weird treasure. All right, now we rock the wheel up. Oh yeah. Oh, it's up. It goes. Up it goes. Um. Thank you, Sherbzar. No, I'm good, Nick Blue. I'm playing a game right now. I don't really want to watch YouTube. I'm not sure. I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. I don't think I want to watch music videos on my stream right now because I got to figure out how to get it to go up. You can die happy. Oh, it's awesome. I'm happy to hear that. I think I got to sho shove this in here. I got to shove this in here to stop. Yeah. Shove that in and keep it up. 
We're looking for like secret treasures is what we're doing. What we're doing is it's tough. It's tough to find secret treasures, man. All right, now we can go down there. Oh. No. <laughs> Site extrapolation complete. Simulation potential maximized. We maximize the simulation potential. A liturgical fan inscribed. A liter. What is this? A fan? Lit liturgical fan. Found. From Princess, what now? A liturgical fan inscribed, I was reading that, inscribed for Empress Theodora. Silver plate, gold inlay, extrapolation ex indicates existing site feature. So somebody probably stole this fan too. It's another stolen object. Site maximized. All right, the site has now been maximized. All right, that was an easy puzzle. That was so easy. They should make the puzzles harder. <laughs> yeah. Where in the world is Carmen Sanier? All right, I think I am now supposed to probably go to. Where would that dude want me to? Um. Um. That dude want me to uh. Go to the. We gotta go to the book bazaar. Sharif is away. We gotta go to the book bazaar. What's a book bazaar? How do we get to the book bazaar? Book bazaar? I'm supposed to go to a book bazaar? I don't, I don't see book bazaar. You guys see book bazaar? Is it near the rug shop? Is it at the park? Go to a book bazaar. What do I have to do? I don't know about no book bazaar. Oh, maybe I have to actually hold on. Um. Oh. Mehmet, where are you? My sister is sick with worry. Come to my shop in the book bazaar as soon as you can. Is it a book bazaar? Do I? Did now we have access to a book bazaar? Oh, here, book bazaar. Cover a virus. Could be a virus. Extras pelated. <laughs> Excuse me. The the hotel. Okay, hotel. Thank you. Can I help you? It sounds like you speak a lot of languages. Of course, it's necessary. Here we have customers all over the world: Russian, Italian, German, French, Croatian. Everyone has money to spend. Some of these things look ancient. Are they antiques? You like it, right? I have something better for you. Before the Sultans brings you good luck and very good price for you, eight million lira. Huh? Sure. Good decision, top quality. You tell your friends, yes? Sure, I guess so. Did I just buy that from this scammer? What did you give me? What is this? has an M on it. Why to buy this? Cool, uh, thanks. Okay. Oh. Let's try showing him this, uh, thing we got. Let's try showing him this. Yeah. Ooh, this one is not so valuable. Uh, only a copy of an old thing. It's weird B ring. Nice souvenir, though. Very accurate. Would you like something else? Here is much better quality. He doesn't say anything about it. How about this sun thing? Oh, here you go. Ah, I've seen such things. The bee belongs to goddess Artemis. From the Greek times. Oh, that's an Artemis thing. Supposedly has the key to. Show him the picture of Mehmet. Mehmet. Show him... Sir. Yeah, maybe she'd be an interpreter and selling selling tchotchkes. Hey Tom Rush. It's worse Dr. Disrespect now. Book bazaar. This is bizarre. Eight million lira is one point six million. 
1.16 million. I guess we just spent 1.16 million dollars. I guess. Took around the book bazaar. Okay. Can I help you? Hey. It's a Fred Armisen. I'm looking for Mehmet Bahis. Then you don't know where he is. No. I have called everywhere, but no one seems to know where he is. The whole family is concerned. First Emre, now this. I'm good, Agrimar. How are you? Where do you think Mehmet could be? But I don't know. Nobody knows. Anybody? I saw him at the university. He sounded like he was in trouble. It's his own making. My poor sister warned him. This gambling of his. He owed everything and to the worst kind of people. Too much gambling. Did his gambling have anything to do with Emre's death? It had everything to do with it. I am sorry, but it's <laughs> true. Mehmet let Emre work after that for him. Oh. What did Emre do to work? What did, who did Emre work for? No, 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 no. Take your question somewhere else. No? You don't want to help? Okay. Alright. Look at these books. Wonderful books. Maybe he'll give me a clue through with his books. The Sultan Durrani. You like that one, Emre, too? They wrote all over the margins. Take it. Oh. Clues from Emre in that book. Okay. Yamsak Tulsa. That's one of my favorites. He wrote all over the margins. Lost myth and magic of the ancient world of the Greeks. The city of bees. Three sets of guiding principles. The Ephesian letters. Arasa Shops 41. Emre wrote all over these, this, huh? Oh, just on this one page. The writings of Diogenes mention a number of obscure superstitions from the Ionian coast. One of the most curious of these hails from the ancient city of bees. Ancient periods, Alexander the Great. The charm he describes centers around seven words or letters of power, although the words themselves are simple. Dark earth, light, sun, tr year, truth, and sea. The written combination of correct utterance of them was thought to imbue great power. This belief may have its roots in symbolic representation. The correct use of the words suggests a harmonious universe through the relationship of three sets of opposites balanced around a guiding principle. Written words often in the form of inscribed stone tablets were carried as a ward against black magic. Wrestlers used them, sometimes surreptitiously, to ensure victory in combat. The spoken words had power as well, as illustrated by the tale of King Croesus's miraculous escape from the, his funeral pyre. According to one version, it was his recitation of these Ephesian letters that caused the heavens to open and douse the deadly flames. Shit. It's a slam dunk right there. Our legs! What do you mean? It's a good game, it's just not, like, designed right. This is a good game, it's just not designed right. It's, like, impossible to know, like, what the hell you have to do. Uh, I'm gonna go back, actually, we gotta go back to this. And we gotta click on... We gotta click on... Oh, we gotta, we gotta click, not here, but here. These are two different click spots, okay? Don't think that this one is the same as this one, even though they're basically in the exact same spot. How dare you? Ancient treasure sells for a record price. Last night in Geneva, a rare 6th century artifact, once owned by a Byzantine empress, was sold at auction for a record-setting price. An unknown buyer listed it in the catalog as a liturgical fan. So that's the thing we just found. So these ancient treasures we're finding in the VR are being sold at auction or at the black market. He didn't believe that Dr. Nossel said the purchaser did not represent a museum. So there's some sort of weird, weird thing going on there. Alright, so we're supposed to... Go, after, go to the Arasta Bazaar. That's what we saw in the book. I think we're supposed to go there now. The Arasta. How do we get a... What's this? Oh, these are like Turki uh, Turkish figures, figurines. Mm -hmm. There's a bit of a clue. Rant's got to think we found. What? Oh, he just went to say something as I ran away. The Arasta. Now we go to the Arasta, Rant Scott. City of Bees. Yeah. 
City of Bees. City of Bees. Still want to call this a good game? Yes. This is a good game. I am having fun. I am in... Mysteries are not all, you know, explosions. Sometimes you gotta put your nose to the grindstone and get out on the beat, Magic Eel. No, English! Oh, please, please come in! Everything is for you! Good prices and best in all Istanbul! Don't yell! Stop yelling! Don't yell at me! You scared the shit out of me! Alright, what's going on in here? Maybe I'm supposed to show him some stuff. What are you doing down there? <laughs> Stop it! Stop doing that. You have a customer in your shop. Please, sir. What are you doing? Sir, what are you doing? What are you doing down there? What are you doing? No, that's disgusting. <laughs> sir, 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 sir. Is this customary in... <laughs> Show him the ring of bees. All right, what are you doing here? <laughs> Everything's about you! We're on the beat, Magic Eel. Hey, Mummy 12. Hey, Jaeger. Everything is for you! That's a really good... That's a really good sales pitch. <laughs> Everything's for you! <laughs> now I have to buy something. Zoom in here. Got sacks of... Beautiful? Yes? Very rare. Good price for you. Um, my friend, just for you, just for you, it's 3 million liras. Yes, yes, 3 million liras. Yes. All right, I'll buy it, sure. Oh, buy everything. Very nice. <laughs> I'm the only one in your shop, nice. I'm two feet away from you. So, this is your first visit to our city. Stop happening, sir. Beautiful and crowded. So, <laughs> Stop polishing your wares. Can I for directing you to my shop? Or did you come with yourself? My friend Emre, homie. Emre Bachis. Ah, Emre. I know his uncle, Mehmet. He's a good businessman. Knows how to get good price for himself. But top quality. He used Bex export agents in Vienna. Same as mine. Of course, Mehmet charges extra for his services. He's a very clever man. Ah. Clever man. Okay. I don't know. What did I just buy? I just bought something, right? I bought a sack of something. Oh, Earth Truth. Oh, these are all the words in um, from the book. And these stone replicates famous Ephesian letters to bring health, money, virtuous, virtuous fortune to the buyer. In ancient time, the people were strongly rumoring that these words contained power and sacred goddess magic. By proper saying, the buyer can be saved from fire, as was the King Croesus of the Greeks from his funeral pyre. It is also known that a contestant will be victorious when he holds these stones to his body and his enemies will destroy him when they can steal the words from him. Okay, so we got a bunch of stones. These are for a puzzle. Most likely. Sharpening his tool back there. Doom, doom, doom. What else can we look at here? What kind of stream is this? A perverted, disgusting, yelling porn stream. Bitumen. It's a yelling man. Disgusting. Porn stream. Let's make sure we didn't miss a click. <laughs> All right. So in here we got a bag. Uh. Okay. I guess that's all we're supposed to do. Gule 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 gule. Na na na. So we found out about this um, if, uh, Ephesius, this Ephesius situation. So maybe we have to find out more about Ephesius by going back to the museum. Can we give sub a lot? Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah. Do that. That would be a good alert. Save that. 19. Ephes... Good idea, good idea. Mess around. 
All right, so we have to go to a random person in here now again. It's spot on for visiting the shops. Kind of accurate like that. Very uh, boisterous. I would like to go here. Outside of a game. Do I show her this? Oh, I show. Okay, you can show her the things. City of Epis. Ephesus, of course. The name comes from Epis, the Greek word for bee. Very symbolic. The bee stings its enemies, but produces an abundance of sweetness. There are many ties there, to Greek mythology and Alexander the Great, of course. Where's Ephesus? On the Aegean coast. It was a thriving port for centuries, but slowly the sea moved away from it. That's what saved the city for archaeologists. There was no great battle that tore it down. It was simply abandoned when the water left. How does Alexander the Great fit in? Alexander conquered the Persians. When he came to Ephesus, it was under Persian rule, but the people were so dissatisfied that they welcomed Alexander, and he took the city with no bloodshed. That's very nice. <laughs> the jewels. <laughs> wax on, wax on. How is the no article coming? Oh. Were you able to speak with Jeremy? Who? I forget who that is. He's the contest. He's the consultant on top copy restoration, right? He's an interesting character, isn't he? The blue jeans but guy. But he has the most amazing connections. Oh, I don't know where he. Where is he? Jeremy is the sort that gets in touch with you. Oh. I'm never sure who he is staying with while he's here, but you should try the bazaars. He's always hoping to run across a treasure. All right. If you are interested in Ephesus, you should look at our Alexander exhibit. We are very proud of that collection. All right, your phone's ringing. Should I show her this other crap? His ring? Ring of bees? Very pretty. Worthless, I'm afraid. A fine copy, but certainly not authentic. So that's worthless, she says. What about the sun disk? Seen uh, on the restaurants. Ooh, I like to we go there. We have hundreds of them in the museum vaults. <laughs> Items <laughs> like these were used as temple offerings. You can't take that out of the country, you know. Turkish law forbids the removal of antiquities. Okay, so this one's valuable then. The sun thing is valuable. Or it's like worth real can't take it the greek thing it is fmv time yeah this game has the fmvs you're learning i'm sorry david the game is making us learn a lot we can't we can't skip the learning unfortunately Does alexander like bees hmm she's not here Uh, how so? Sh okay. All right, Sharif is back. Who owns the VR place? Who runs the VR place? Oh, she doesn't even say anything. She's worried about being murdered. I replaced the missing scans in the Basilica Cistern Sim. Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. According to Cleo, there was a silver liturgical fan in the Basilica Cistern. I don't even know if the simulations are accurate anymore. There's been so much tampering. Oh, really? Being tampered? You don't... Okay. Emre was studying Ephesus before he died. Do you have any Clio simulations connected with Ephesus? Yes, I do. Sick. Then I'd like to see it. I've decided this isn't such a good idea to allow just anyone to tamper with my files without supervision. I've canceled your access code. Ah. Why? I thought we were helping each other. The police have been here asking questions again. This time they're about you. And I suddenly realize I don't know the answers. Oh. I'm the only lead the police have. They're looking for the same answers I am. The truth is so elusive, isn't it? Help me. If I can't prove this, they'll arrest me. <sighs> All right. That was easy. But I already checked the simulation. There are no missing files. I'll show you. There is nothing mm -hmm. here for you. Mm -hmm. 
No missing files. All right, so we don't have to go scan crap this time. Nice. All right, puzzle section. Library of Celsus at Ephesus, second century AD, Imperial Roman period. Five summers have I spent in far. All right, strap in. The Ionians have erected their towns under the finest of sky and sweetest climate. Removed 1904. Strap in here. Now we're in this Ephesius place. I got partial scroll. Another scroll. Was this the mean? Emperor Caesar? No, the Emperor no, no, Caesar no, 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 no. Oh, that's just learning. We don't want to learn. Ephesian locking mechanism. Warning. Here we go. Current data display is inaccurate. Manual yeah. overwrite in source code has destabilized site matrix. Oh. Okay. What's this stuff? Some letters. Clone notes writes that the Amazon maidens founded the great city of Ephesus on the sea, but he's a poet. His words cannot be trusted. Here's a tale I've heard. Androcles, whose father was Codros, the king of Athens, wished to create a new settlement abroad. Androcles ventured east with his friends and entered into Anatolia. Okay, that's cool. The skin anointed with golden ointment, effeminately dressed in soft robes and delicate slippers, chewing onions, munching cheese, eating raw eggs, sucking shellfish, quaffing goblets of rich chion, and carrying in soon leather bags the Ephesian letters of good omen. We've got those letters. Or we've we've got the letters, but it doesn't really let me... I must have to do find something to be able to manipulate that. All right, we got... Head of Socrates. Socrates. Letter from an unknown Ionian. Okay, let's read that. It is true that Alexander showed great interest in the reconstruction of the temple. Funds for work got low. He commissioned a bust in his own likeness. Alexander. Oh, I wonder if that's the treasure here. Ale bust, gold bust of Alexander. Alexander the Great. I already looked on the table. Library interior. Over here. We got another decree. A lot of letters in this one. Gaius Julia Aquila dedicate this library as a center of learning and debate in honor of my father, Gaius Julius Celsius Polmanius, late preconsul of the province of Asia. All who come here recognize his attributes, wisdom, knowledge, intelligence, and virtue, and honor the bones that rest here, decked in marble. To the citizens of the great city of Ephesus, I also grant 25,000 denarii to maintain and augment the volumes sheltered herein. Let the exalted achievements of Gaius Julius Celsius Palmenes be remembered by the Roman people. A confusing game. Okay, so we're reading shit. We read some shit. Library interior. And there's... How do I actually manipulate? To you... To you... Do I need to, uh... This is wrong, which means I need to fix it. I can't, like, move this stuff. I can't mo actually move it. It doesn't let me move it. I need to use these items on here. It doesn't actually let me, like, move anything. It just says it's wrong. Maybe I need to go find the right setup and then come back. Hey, Marty. <laughs> I blow you away with your stream. My stream. Thanks, Marty. You blow me away with the, your viewing. Story of this game seems complicated. <laughs> yeah, it's like a, it's like a thousands of years long story. Mm-hmm. Well, I thought I was going to be confused again. Um. Confused again. So we go in here. We. Oh, hold on. Oh, I was going to the wrong thing.
we go into the sim four statues along the front yeah we got knowledge thought virtue and wisdom cool and there's a game on the steps this oh I didn't see this totally missed that thing nine man Morris yes all right we're gonna nine man Morris finally okay what do we got to do get three in a row it's easy I'll use my patented strat oh man does this count? Does it has to be three in a line, right? I'm gonna get my ass kicked. Oh, no. Hopefully he'll be really bad. Oh, and then you place all the stones and then you move them. Okay, my, I use my patented strat, which always works. This strat. One there. One there. Oh, it looks like you just lost, son! Seventh grade nine man Morris strat pays off. Came up with that strat seventh grade. Where are the bees? I don't know. We'll see some soon. You have a blast exploding and dying in an entertainment drum bomb dropped by me. No problem. You, so you'd enjoy being dead from being entertained so much. Thanks, Marty. Hey, Goaty. Yeah, nine man Morris. It's Nine Man Morris, Goaty. And we just destroyed it with my patented strat. Wait, I gotta play again? Wait, did that have no purpose? My patented strat. Go there. Go there. Oh, you just got destroyed, son, again. Wait, was there, was there a point in winning at this? Is there even a point at winning? There's no, not even any point in winning that. Enter the building, get the scrolls. Go to the self for scrolls. There are scrolls that you pick up. Um, there's a narrow doorway in here. Nice wind. Why is there wind blowing in this VR sim? There's apparently a, na a door over here? Something like that? There's a... This? Is this the door we're talking about? On the top panel for a close-up view. We don't know what the puzzle wants yet, so we just gotta leave. Alright, that's fine. <laughs> yeah, nine men more, so you gotta get three in a row. There's also a version we played in other games where you, you place all the tiles, pieces, and then you have to move your pieces around one at a time. Um. Okay. So now you're supposed to do, now you're supposed to open up these and then scan them. How would you know that? I don't know how you're supposed to figure out anything in this game. You have to scan your tiles, which you've never been able to scan anything in your inventory. I don't, so, I don't know. Maybe I'm, I'm, I'm too close-minded. Scan complete, you scan the tiles. So now the tiles will go into the sim, right? Maybe we can uh, also scan other stuff, like this B-ring. Like, why couldn't we scan the, uh, I guess you can't scan a photo. Oh, we can scan this B-ring, too. Let me scan those. Let me scan the sun, also. Or, this might not be for this one. This might be for a different one. No, it's for this one, too. We can at least scan them all in. So we can ca scan stuff. Scan complete. Do I need to scan this too? No, we don't scan that. I right, just scanned all that stuff. Now we try going back in. Okay. Oh, we gotta have her upload it now too. For some reason she has to upload it now, even though we didn't have to do that before. She's overriding files. What? Did you scan this in or no? 
You didn't get anything new. Oh. Okay. You confused me with what you said, lady. Let's go in. Let's jack back in. Minds you have missed. Mist is great, though. Mist is great. Mist is very, very good. Okay, now we've got. Okay, now we've got a bunch of tiles here. Okay. Second century A.D. Imperial Roman. Yeah. Uh huh. All right, here we go. Why would they put a puzz in there and not make it integral to the game? Winning is just pointless. All right, now we got these tiles. We can use these. Okay, do I need to like... Okay, so you can replace the tiles. Did I happen to get the correct one? Okay. Hmm. You can use... Did I just happen to put the right one? How do you know what goes where? Did it only let, does it only let you put the right one in the right place? Wait, so... No, there's no way the pu this puzzle works like this. That it only lets you put the correct one in the correct place, that would make... That's not how it works. I'm just not doing this correctly. I'm just placing them randomly. No, that's not right. No, still anonymous... An anomalous data. Touch this, touch this. Oh. Oh. Now I'm swapping them. Oh, these are the right tiles. But we gotta put them in the right place. How is this working? Okay. Swaps these two. So you can swap these two, these two, these two. Uh, okay, so... Let me see. We have C... No, hold on. Let me back out. I don't feel like I put that right. You know this. C, dark, year, and truth. We need C, dark, year, and truth. Where does this... Where does this come from? C, dark, year, and truth. Is this from one of these documents? I don't think it's this one. Sea Dark Year and Truth. I don't think it's this one. Sea Dark Year and Truth. I think it's this one. Sea Dark Year and Truth. I don't think it's this one. Do you get these games? Uh, I just randomly look for them sometimes. Leave it. <laughs> randomly looked yeah I see the swaps it's swapped see dark you're in truth how do you like where would you no where would you Sun and earth that would go with like truth maybe can I swap there we go with truth Sun and truth and earth and Sun and light goes with dark Sun dark and light See, earth and light, truth, earth and light is truth, earth and sea and sun and year and dark and just try every combo. I don't, I don't really know. Oh, it was you were, what you were replacing, right? Hold on, we got to do it again. Got to think about the proper, I don't know how you're supposed to know. You just have to find things that make sense so virtue is, could be truth virtue could be truth year would be like knowledge dark would be i don't know what dark would be and sun sun uh, i'm not really sure so i don't know truth knowledge <laughs> truth could be maybe knowledge wisdom like if you as you're older Where's a where's, uh, year? Year, wisdom as you get older. You know, you have wisdom. Mm, you, you think in the dark. Those thought and replace with dark. And then the last one. Um, where's the sea? The truth is found in the sea. In the virtue, I mean. Hey, many tacos. Yeah, we're playing this game today. I'm not going insane at all.
We made it in. I'm going into a crypt. Warning. Current data display is inaccurate. Manual override and source code has destabilized site matrix. It's destabilized. It's unstable. Got real loud. Okay. It's anonymous. It's anomalous. Yeah, we're in, you're in Turkey in this game, learning about Turkey. I mean, yeah, Turkey. Right, so we have to find a tomb. Is she know? We have to find a tomb. I think we go back to the museum. We always go back to the museum when we need to figure something new out. There was that big, um... Oh, who's here? Bak, bunu benim için yapmalısın. Yapman gereken bir iş var ve bu Hayır, çok... artık vazgeçti, bitti. Ama çok önemli. What happened here? The detective told me you work for him. I should have told you before, but I didn't think you'd understand. They hired me to spy on Emre, but I became more involved with him than that. I didn't betray him. I had nothing to do with his death. But listen to me. They're gathering evidence against you. If you can't prove your innocence, they will blame you. There always has to be a scapegoat. Please be careful. I knew I was right about Emre. I couldn't get anyone else to blame me. He was trying to do the right thing. That's what got him killed. Thank you for believing in him too. Puzzles. Thought this is hungry. Nah, it's turkey. Nah, Felhin. Yeah, you make that mistake a lot. It's turkey, son. Okay, so there was um, there was like a tomb out here. We need to find a tomb. I thought it was this tomb. Yeah, this tomb. Do we scan it? Oh, free trip to Turkey. <laughs> you got to make a game. Maybe that's what happened. That happens a lot. Like Capri. That's kind of well. They lived in Capri. The people that made the Capri games. Blame you? No, I would never blame chat. Hungry for Turkey? You're hungry for Turkey. So we scan that. And we saw those two people arguing. Right, let's go back into the sim. Never blame chat. Don't ever do that. Take responsibility as a streamer. Okay. It's your stream. It's your... It has nothing to do with chat. Alright, upload that tomb, lady. Upload that tomb. Oh, she's overriding files. Why, why does she say it like that? <laughs> she just said, like, it's overriding files. Don't say, like, oh, she's overriding files. And does that mean you loaded it up, or what does that mean? You're confusing. Confusing me. Katie Bug, it's going well. We're solving a mystery. We're solving a mystery. It's growing great. Library of Celsus know, at I've, Ephesus. I've been here many times Second before. Century AD. And I've been here many Imperial times Roman before. Period. I know, I've been here. Can you blame chat? Madigan, you can. You're in chat. Thanks for t timing out chat, Tonda. Thank you. Alright, now we go back into the tomb because we scanned it in. Uh, anomalous data. I gotta use the... Uh, extrapolating, extrapolating, extrap... Extra oplating Sarcophagus of Celsus Offering Ball Embedded Macro. Ooh, put the sun in there. Macro complete. Ooh, activating hidden files. Sub simulation Emre 7421. Yo, oh, Emre. Emre made this simulation. Oh, we got a secret simulation made by the guy, my friend who died. Here. Temple of Artemis at Ephesus, third century BC. The Temple Hellenistic of period. Temple of Artemis. Okay, locking mech. Locking mech. Oh, is that where the ring goes? Okay. Okay. Scan that stuff in here. Okay. 
Still forcing you to learn. I'm trying to squ quiet it as much as possible, but yeah, unfortunately. We're going upstairs. No puzzle. Well, no puzzle has stumped me, Fargo. I don't... I, I don't say that I'll never be stumped, but I've always been able to solve every puzzle I've ever been presented with immediately, without any delay. So. In all mystic sacrifices and myth. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to say no puzzle will ever stump you, just none ever has out of thousands and thousands that I've tried. Thanks for the host, Gok. Need more coffee? Nope. I've already drank and drank a good amount, Master Nate. I'm drinking a good amount today. Hey, Boston. What's up, Boston? Go around the other side. Mm -hmm. ah, uh, uh, ah. Go around to this other door. Hmm, go around to the other side. Can I... Oh, maybe you do something. What items do I have? I've got these documents and I've got... I might have to go get... I didn't really explore down there. So I might have to use items that I get down there up here. That I didn't get because I didn't... I just immediately came to the door and used the ring. Might have to go back down. Hey, Rage Key. Regeki. Regeki. Puzzle Savant. No, I'd say... No, I'm still a whiz. I don't think I could go down that other door. Let's look around. Let's look around. I've actually been surprised by how many people told me that they uh, played this game as like a and, and enjoyed it. So that's pretty cool. What's up, Shane? Thank you for the raid. How's it going, Shane? Byzantine the Betrayal. Like there, here you go. Ray Gecki's played. Ray Ray Gecki's played this game. I never heard of it. A lot of people have apparently played this game. So that's cool. It's good. Shane, thanks for the raid. What's up, man? An FMV game you never heard of. Oh, yeah, you're in. Okay, I'm glad you're in, Shane. Sh strap yourself in. Sometimes we get stabbed. The coolest part of this game so far is that sometimes you get brutally stabbed. <laughs> Thanks for the raid, Shane. If you guys don't follow Shane, throw him a follow. Good streamer. Good guy to hang out with. Playing Deadly Premonition 2 currently. And uh, are you still enjoying it, Shane? Thanks for that raid. I appreciate it. Still enjoying it? Okay, offering table. Uh, I don't have. We need. We need a bunch of thingies. We need a bunch of thingies that we don't have. Thank you, Shane. Hey, one true uncle. What's up, Emperor? Uh, John B. Beauty, what's up, John? Yeah, just like in life. Just like real life. This game's just like real life. Sometimes you get stabbed. I don't see anything down here. It's offering. There's an offering table down here. We need ingots. We need some ingots. We gotta collect some ingots. I see him. Don't worry, I see him. Gameplay is not great, but it's goofy. Well, that's good. As long as it's interesting in some way. It doesn't have to be good, you know? Oh, we must need to get... Oh, I see more over here. That's the thing. A game doesn't have to be good. At least for streaming. It just has to be... Have some sort of... How many do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I need one more. Where is it? Is it really not here? Interesting in some way. Let's so see if this is enough. If we needed nine or eight or... I got eight. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Damn it. Do I have to arrange these in a proper order? I need to get one more. Maybe I, miss, maybe I missed it. Okay, I'm missing one. We need to go find one. Let's look on. We gotta look down. This is a look down puzz. We look down at the ground. Hmm, looks like we got them all. Where's the last one? Maybe there's one on the ground. Upstairs. But, but someone handed me a puzzle box from Hellraiser. Could I resist solving it? Or is the puzz instinct too great to withstand? No, I couldn't resist solving it. I would have to try to solve it immediately. I, I've never seen Hellraiser. What happens in that movie? It's got puzzles in it. Sounds pretty fun. 
near, 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 near. Let's look back outside. I don't think we looked outside. I didn't see any up here. I feel like I would have saw them. Appreciate anyone that tries to do something way out there, even if it doesn't succeed. Yeah, because see, sometimes just yeah, that, that can that can be good enough. Sometimes. In four places sacred buildings enriched with sculpture and Me ornament too. of such description as to entitle them to be called most famous, and these from their excellence and. Me too. Even if they fail horribly, I still appreciate. You can still appreciate what people are trying to do sometimes. All right, this is. Wait, what? There's like a tiny little. Okay. But the temple oh. of the Ephesian Artemis is a. Shh. No learning. No, I don't like horror f movies, David. I think Hellraiser's a horror movie, right? Okay. Do I have to look at all these individually? I can kind of see the okay so now I've got 10 of these things kind of hard to see I got I got an extra one it's kind of hard to see demons pop out oh really do I dabble with mechanical puzzles not really I think they're cool actually Alice sent me one that uh, Alice sent me one. I had, I forgot. I keep forgetting about it. She was doing those. This um. Let's go to the mist car. This like ball in a puzzle. I mean ball in a. You got to get the ball out or wait. What is the goal of this? I forget. <laughs> I forget the goal. Yeah, yeah. You got to get the log out. You got to get this out of here. But it's bolted in. It's bolted in and there's like a ball in there. And you gotta try to get this out. You gotta try to undo the um, bolt. It's got a bolt in there. You gotta somehow undo it. But I I haven't tried it for a while. I forgot I had it kind of. I mean like I keep forgetting. I think you gotta somehow use the ball to like turn the counterclockwise, right? Okay, I gotta get it the other way. Counterclockwise. Counterclockwise. You gotta somehow like wedge the ball in there. I feel like I might be able to do it like right now. Oh, but it's it has to be high up enough. Kind of like you gotta go counterclockwise. Oh, I'm making it go clockwise. Now, right like here, you gotta undo the bolt. Films are gruesome. Yeah, I'm not totally into that stuff. I'm not into gruesome stuff. Really, most of the time. Yeah, um, I don't have any. I don't really care about Rubik's cube. I liked as a kid. I'm not into it anymore. But I like this kind of puzzle for sure, for sure. Fish hooks, hooks your face in. Never understood why it was not more popular, right, Yeki? I mean, it's, um, I don't think it's per designed perfectly well, even though it is interesting in a lot of ways. I think it has a lot of design flaws. Kind of like, gotta turn the bolt. I mean, you gotta turn the bolt, right? You gotta wedge it in there and turn the bolt, right? Uh, did I do it? Did it make it turn a little bit? Is it turning? I feel like it's not supposed to be this hard. It's not supposed to be this. It's not supposed to be like this. You have the whole Hellraiser set on DVD. How dare you? I don't know if it turned. It felt like I might have turned it a little bit. Why is the why is the pins in there? Why are the pins in there? I don't understand why the pins are in there. Gotta like do something with the pins. That, the pins in here. There we go. Why? What are the pins in here for? What do that? What do they do? What is their deal? Why are they in there? Just to screw with you? It's like a red herring. I think I I I, I indented the ball. <laughs> I, I, maybe you're not supposed to do it like this. Because I put a big indent in the ball. <laughs> There's like creases in the ball in here now. Probably can't see it, but I put creases in that ball. I, I'm going to give up. My hands hurt. <laughs> uh, cube opens gateways. Cube opens gateways. I'm glad you like it, uh, Nat. Just playing with my balls. You're allowed to play with your balls. Ouch. You get smashed the bottle. That's true. I'd, I'd be interested in trying to figure that out. But uh, I, I want to... How? What are you supposed to do? 
There's probably some like really really easy way to turn You have to turn the nut right the screw whatever it is the bolt you have to turn the bolt Or maybe you're not supposed to do it on that side. You're supposed to just turn the nut I think you got to turn the nut. Remember the time I cut my hand? Yeah, yeah. Gmail, you're right. I got to be more careful. Maybe you're just supposed to turn the nut. And this thing gets in the way of that. Wait, it's now stuck on the wall. You're supposed to turn the nut, not the bolt. Let's try turning the nut. The nut is way easier to turn than the bolt, right? You know the solution. No, you don't. <laughs> hey, Rand Scott. <laughs> hey, Gmail. How'd they put it in there? Yeah, how the hell they put it in there, those bastards? All right, let's try to do the same thing on the nut side. <laughs> I'm, I'm breaking, what if I smash the ball and it's important? What if I can't solve it because I accidentally break, smash the ball in half with my ridiculous brute force tactics? <laughs> I don't think you're supposed to. The ball is all indented. Let me try to show you. Let me try to show you. The ball is all, I can zoom in. See? Can you see the indents in the ball? <laughs> hey, thanks for the follow. See the indents in the ball? <laughs> this ball's not hard enough. <laughs> Thinking about pinheads? Uh, yo, neat polygons. Uh, hey, NTJ, hello. <laughs> this is not how you're supposed to do it. This is not how you're supposed to do it. It's something with this pin. It's like a double weird pin. Weird pin. Maybe the pin is like the second half. You got to get the bolt off first and you got to figure out the pin. I really think it's like wedging the, uh... Yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hurt myself. I'm going to hurt something. I'm going to hurt myself. Only 10 when you played it. Yeah, um... Alright. This. So, yeah, on this game, this game does some things that... Always piss me off in adventure games. Like, um, giving you a ton of locations and you have to randomly figure out, there's like no indication of where you need to go. You just have to go to a location you've already explored. And then the person just randomly showed up there. And they're, it's not like they're even at the front door. They're like deep in the location somewhere. And it does it many, many, many times. Do you miss the ending of Byzantine? No, this is still Byzantine. No. No, we were just trying to summon, TJ mentioned puzzles so I whipped out a puzzle that I had Alice sent me thank you Alice for that puzzle my hand hurts a lot <laughs> yeah I got dead end myself I got I got I got dead ended soft locked I like that kind of puzzle that's just this is supposedly um, a five star puzzle like maximum difficulty puzzle it says that's a five-star puzzle. Here's the box. Five-star puzzle. Remove the stick and unveil the secret of the Grease's true genius. Yeah, you have to undo the nut. Take everything out of the bottle and then return everything back inside with the metal pin and screw reconnected to the wooden dowel. So you don't have, you don't only have to take it out. You got to put it back inside too. I don't know, I could think about it some more. This was shouting out Alice. Hey, Gusak. Oh, man. All right, well, now we got some Zodiac stuff here. Let's make sure there's nothing else outside. Hey, Ed Nocta. Load to save? I think we're all right. You go, can we go over here? Boundary. Goom, goom, goom. Or, um, no. There's no more, right? I don't see any more. None out here, right? Okay, over here. We go to any other parts. <laughs> okay, I don't see any more. Maybe we got them all. Hopefully I wasn't supposed to listen to all the voices. Doom, 
do 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 Let's go back upstairs. Maybe there's an maybe there's another one of these up here. It's trickier to get it back together, I imagine. I imagine part of it is they always do the putting it back together thing. Yeah, don't don't spoil that thing. But yeah, that's my idea is to use the ball somehow. Don't spoil real life. Don't spoil the real life pause. Break bottle. Hey Dave. Are looking for any more of these things? Glue it back together. That might be the solution. Could be it. Could be it. Oh, low to save <laughs> back before the ball got dead ended. Oh, okay, here we go. Alright, we got them all. But now what? Does it show around her neck? I oh, mean, that's so hard to see. That's what I'm talking about. Like, this game makes mistakes in just how it's designed. I can't even tell what those are. Is that fish? Let's see, so we got... We got fish. I can't tell what the second one. The third one looks like a chicken. <laughs> the f I mean, these are... these. Are, I Can you guys... Is that a fish? No, the first one's a fish. What's the second one? Yeah, they're zodiacs. They are. But I can't tell what it is. Can I click on it and look at it? This... Oh, this is this is a person. Is this um... Like... Like an, a fish man? A fish person? And then the third one? Like a D Denver the Last Dinosaur? This one is like a horse? That's, a, that's definitely... Cancer. Two... Three... So I don't know, I don't know, I... Oh, centaur. Centaur, and then a uh, crab, crab or a uh, scorpion. Which I think is like can that? cancer. Thanks, Mecca, for the 50. Da -da -da -da. Ziggles redeemed Brandon Ward. Is this game scary? No, not at all. You do get stabbed a couple times, Gmail. Random word. Ziggles. Let's get a random word for Ziggles. Ziggles, your random word is pomology, the study of fruit growing. Pomology, the study of fruit growing. Yeah, so this is how we find out what to put where. Maybe I need to look at all the pieces. It'll help me figure out what's around this thing's neck. Uh, okay. Let me put five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right, this is Leo, the lion. The last one is like a crab. I don't know what, um, I, I can't see these. Uh, that's definitely a scorpion on five. Six is, is that, seven is a bull? Maybe it's a bull? <laughs> I can't see, I can't tell. Can you guys tell? Man with a fishtail, it did kind of look like a man with a fishtail. Let me look at all these, maybe it'll help. Okay, I don't know. Okay, it doesn't even have like the... Okay, we're, if you can't see the symbols in the... Okay. Zodiac signs. What's your zodiac sign? Zodiac signs compared with zodiac signs and animals. I'll just look it up. I want to see the, um, can I, there's anything that has them all together? Zodiac, Zodiac animals and symbols. Because I don't think they're in the game. Zodiac animals and symbols. Here we go. Astrology chart with the animals and the symbols. But doesn't, this doesn't have the names. And the names too. Okay, here we go. Here's what we got. We got what we need. Okay, so we got. Here's what we got. Here's what we got. All right, so we got yeah, fish. So one is Pisces. Okay, and then the Pisces is this thing, this symbol. We got the crab is Cancer, and that's like the two eyeballs. We got the lion, which is Leo, and that's like a thing with a weird tail. 
We got. I think that was a bull, so I'm gonna guess Taurus, and Taurus is that symbol. Um, was there a fish man? We did have a centaur. That's Sagittarius. I didn't know that. The so Sagittarius is like kind of an arrow. The scorpion. A scorpion. Wait, why is it not? Why is the one in the corner? Is this like a? What's the scorpion one? Damn it. Aquarius is the fish man. Okay, Aquarius. Okay, so we've got a lot of these. Fish man. Um, okay. That was actually kind of helpful. But what's the, what's the scorpion? Scorpio. <laughs> Why is it not? <laughs> Please, can you actually tell me what it is? Scorpio. What's the Scorpio symbol? Damn it. Almost useful. Thank you for almost being useful. Image. Zodiac symbols. <laughs> like decides not to put it on that zodiac symbols <laughs> this is like a uh, all right scorpio is it's like an m m it's like an m with an arrow all right so we've got we actually know all of them but two i think so we just need to figure out the two remaining all right, we're actually we're actually doing a puzzle. So I don't know this one. This one right here. It looks it looks like a person. A person is involved. I think this is uh, Virgo. This kind of looks like someone holding a leaf. So I'm gonna guess it's Virgo. That's like an M. With a little other crap. It could also be a uh, Libra though. He might be someone holding scales. So it's either that or Libra. I don't think it's any of the other ones. I don't think it's Gemini. That would be two people. Okay. Woof Junk, what's up? Phoenix, hello. Harry Mole. You get stabbed. No, you get stabbed in a scary way. But other than that, it's not scary. You're going to a Japan puzzle museum. What are you doing there, Rand Scott? What are you doing in the puzzle museum? Yeah, I was Aquarius. Okay, sorry, I missed some chat here. I'm sorry about that. Hey, Ziggles. I'm good. Phoenix, thank you. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. We're actually we're actually doing the game. So Pisces, the second thing is Aquarius. The third thing is... What the hell is that? It's like a weird dinosaur. Let me see if this gives me a hint. I don't think it's a bull. I think the bull was on the other side. Oh, it's the weird cat. Oh, that's Capricorn. Okay, that's Capricorn for sure. That's like kind of a strange little symbol here. Okay, all right, so I think we got them all. For, we, the only one we're not sure of is the one that looks like a person, which is either Libra, Virgo, or Gemini. And we can just trial those before until we get it. Um, I'm uh, almost 100% sure on all the other ones. Crabs are people too? No, they're not, they're crabs. I mean, you're kind of a crab person. You don't need to call him cancer. My bad, son. My bad, son. Dun, 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 dun. Might catch up on sleep during the day. How do you guys sleep during the day? I feel like I'm wasting the day if I sleep. Even if I'm tired, I don't. I, I try not to sleep. I don't like sleeping. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, one is fish. So we need to now we need to actually look at every single one of these. <laughs> uh, okay, that. Oh wait, I got the I had the wrong symbols. Not the wrong symbols. These aren't the same symbols as the ones I was looking at. Oh wait, they are. Okay, so this is the M. The M goes on five. This is Scorpio. Maybe I just didn't look at the one. So this is Scorpio, right? Okay, this is still Scorpio. So this goes on five. Alright. I don't so I don't think we had Aries, so that's why I don't think we have this one either. Or unless it's that is that Leo? No circle. That might be Leo, though. Okay, let me look at this one. All right, that is definitely. It's that might be six. Oh, I took it away. Oh, now it's reorganizing my cards when I didn't. Okay. It replaced my cards. So this one might be the sixth one. Oh, I can kind of see it. Okay. All right, that one is the ninth one. I have to make sure I don't click out of this or it reorganizes all my cards. Maybe I'm, 
I don't know what that symbol is. Maybe I'm too hyper analytical of of puzzle games from playing so many. This is the fourth one. Maybe that's part of my problem. Because you analyze like how all the good games do everything, and then it pisses you off when you play the bad ones. I think there's different different types of symbols. Yeah, there's th I think this is this might be Pisces. Looks kind of like Pisces. Doesn't look exactly. All right, that is um seven. That's Taurus. This one. Seven Taurus. Okay, let me go from the other end. Hey, hey, uh, hey, Joe. The game. No, chat always makes things fifty-fifty. Chat doesn't care. Chat just wants me to be tortured. And chat decided to torture me with a 50-50 vote is what happened. Hey, Cambrian. One of the shot at the champ. The Japanese ring puzzle is supposedly the hardest in the world. Have you? What do you have to do in it? Okay, we're almost done. So I'm looking for... The, um... Uh, what was it? This third one. Which kind of looks like an N not it it might be a different kind of could be this one maybe I need to look for the constellations what was it again which one I'm looking for which one was it Capricorn kind of looks like this this is what this says it is I think it's Capricorn Capricorn constellation that'll make it easier for for us we can look at the constellation Capricorn constellation looks like a, a triangle is that it? Looks like it has more stars than that, though. All the stars in the sky. I'm guessing that's it. Oh, huh? that's okay. I guess I'm guessing that's it. We get it? I don't know. So let's replace six, which is we weren't sure what that was. If it was this or the other one. It might be... I thought it might be... Um, I thought it might be Virgo, but it also might be Libra. So now we need to find the Libra constellation. Oh wait, that was this one. Not that one. We did see that one. Not this one. Not this one. This one. No. Wait, where'd it go? Libra constellation. Libra constellation. Libra constellation. Looks like a kite. A f kite flying. Did I put these wrong? That's not a flying kite. 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 Where's Libra? Is it up here? Wait, there's two missing. I didn't do. I didn't put down Leo either. What's Leo's constellation? Might be more to this puzzle than it seems. Yeah, I don't like to waste days either. Yeah, same with me. Hey, Blobay, did you stay up to compensate? Stay up late, sleep during the day and stay up. I don't want to sleep at all. It looks like carrying some, it looks like a vacuum cleaner, Leo. I didn't have the one on, I didn't even notice. There, this is Leo for sure, because it's a vacuum cleaner. Okay, I, I didn't have Leo on there this whole time. So let me try putting this one back on. Please be right. Damn it. Six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Well, let's just try all of these other ones then. No? Alright, let me try this one then. Aries. No? I feel like all the other ones are correct. Unless three is wrong. That, no, that looks like... Maybe that one is on six. And then one of these is on three. Unless it doesn't, like, change until you... Okay. I tried to figure it out and I failed. Paint eyes on your eyelids. Oh, if you're going to a meeting? It's a good plan. Gotta start making my own. Maybe, yeah. Let's see. Uh, we got crab, Leo, Scorpio, gong, 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 fish. Okay. Uh, oh, maybe you have to. Okay, there is something. You have to go to a newspaper and look it in the game, but we did it a different way. It's Pisces, Aquarius, 
Capricorn. It is Capricorn. A jagged line with several angles. Capricorn. A jagged line with several angles. It's not that. This? No. Not right. Capricorn. Well, maybe I have a different one wrong. Capricorn. Sagittarius. The centaur, right? Sagittarius? Maybe if you look at uh, Sagittarius. Yeah, I got that one. Sagittarius is correct. Got that. We got that one. We got Pisces. Maybe that's not Pisces. Let me check the Pisces constellation. Is Pisces constellation just two dots? Pisces could be wrong. Because Pisces doesn't look exactly right. Pisces looks like an L. That's, a, that's not just two dots. Maybe this one's wrong. It looks like a big old, big old constellation. Do I have all the, do I have them all? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Shit, I'm missing one. How am I missing one? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Damn, I'm missing one. I'm missing one. I'm missing one. I'm missing no. I might be missing Pisces. I might be missing Pisces. Sagittarius, a scorpion. We got that one right. Scorpion is right. Libra, two parallel lines with a bump. So that that one is Libra. Virgo, an M that loops. Wait a second. This is Virgo? Oh, one of these is wrong. Taurus is not... We don't use Taurus. Oh, that's a problem. It's Virgo, the M loop. Really, Virgo? Oh, this is Virgo? Oh, okay. Leo... That's Leo now. Yeah, we got Leo. Leo. Cancer. Okay, Cancer's right. The first one is Pisces. Looks like a stylized H. No, I think Pisces is right. I think they're just not showing the whole... The whole constellation. No, no, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine. It's fine. Well, we might be missing... Capricorn. We might be missing Capricorn. How many do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I'm missing one somehow. How many? Those are twelve, right? I might be missing Capricorn. I might be missing. Let me see. Cap, Cap, -ri, Capricorn constellation. Capricorn constellation is like a triangle. I, I don't. I don't think I have this one. Or Capricorn symbol. It's like a weird N with a swirl. We might not have Capricorn. Where'd it go? I, I thought I picked up 12. I picked up five, four. I'm gonna destroy this game. Um, Capricorn. Have to find another piece somewhere. I, I thought I looked on the floor all over. Just when you think you're making progress. I mean, Puzz Energy. Hmm. Or sleep on stream? I have not, no. No. I would never fall asleep on stream. I would I would never get so tired that I would fall asleep on stream. I would always just turn off the stream first. We're missing one. We're missing Capricorn, I think. Let's assume we need it. We're missing Capricorn. Let me see what it says about where these are in this inventory in this place. You look at the bottom of the bowl, you see items on the floor, we picked them all up. Pick five up in the other room. Large statue of Artemis. You need an item goods. Exit the main chamber, go at the front door. Two on the floor. Move to the left and reach another part of the temple's exterior. One more can be found here on the stairs. Oh, there's one on the stairs. Oh, over here. There's another way you can go. And that's where Capricorn is. I have beheld the Ephesian mirror. Good for you. I'm so happy that you've beheld something. It's, it's always good to behold something once in your life. I'm not the chosen one. I'm the unchosen one, Wu Chunk. Hey, Guinea Prince. All right, so we were missing the one we needed, which is... That one goes over here. I think it's just what I needed. This is two. I have it memorized. That's Taurus. We don't use Taurus. I was wrong about that. That is definitely Pisces, because it's like an H. We don't use that one. We don't use Aries. Okay, this is Capricorn. Yeah, it's like a swirl. 
That's Capricorn, the third one. Then we need... There you go, yeah, um, Centaur, whatever it is. Then we need the M. Okay, these are kind of still in order. Then we need the Omega, that's that one. And then we need the, uh, I thought it was Taurus, but it's Virgo. It's the M, it's fine. Fine, good for you. And then we need, uh, the other one was Leo. Leo the Lion. That's this one. All right, first try. Extrapolating. Extrapolating data. Extrapolating. Extrapolating. What I, I, I yeah, the gold head of Alexander. Sight extrapolation gold bust. complete. Simulation potential maximum. <laughs> System access terminated at source. Simulation potential has been maximized. What is this? What? Your friend created this simulation. I have nothing to do with this. Turning all this up. What are you trying to do? You are trying to ruin my reputation. Get out. You can't put that under Just the microscope. Gmail, thank you for the sub for 11 months. Thank you very much for those puzz dances, man. I appreciate that. Thanks, Gmail. Now that Gmail has subbed, we will give him a shout out. I'm just kidding. We'll do it anyway. I'm going to shout out Gmail if you guys don't follow Gmail. Gmail's a slam dunk streamer. Ugh. Always, always playing, always playing games that are sometimes they're hard to get through, but he doesn't give up. Gmail's not a giver upper. Good inspiration. If you want to stream. Never gives up. What's the longest I've streamed? I'm not really sure. Maybe 13 to, or 14 hours kind of thing. Phoenix, something like that. 12. Tw it's only around 12. I, I don't really believe in doing like the long, really long streams. Or I guess maybe maybe my life just has never been in a place where I could, where I could even do that and, you know, stay alive. Okay, so she's mad at me because these we, simulations are like not hers and we're not exactly sure why. Or we're trying to find, maybe Emre was trying to find other hidden objects by, I see what he might have been doing. He might have been like creating more secret simulations to try to find more objects that he could sell to make money to pay off his uncle's debts. Mehmet, I've looked everywhere for you. I must tell my sister that her husband has disappeared. Please come to my shop in the book bazaar. Oh, it's... Again with that? Yeah, Gmail's favorite game is Road Rash. If you like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Road Rash. That, it's a big Road Rash streamer. There's a newspaper here. Supposed to get a newspaper? Two newspapers. Wow, I haven't been looking at any of these. Antiquity smugglers frustrate police. Interpol investigation recovers treasure, makes no arrest. Are you planning on doing a long stream, Phoenix? Recovers no treasure. See, they're smugglers. They're smuggling artifacts. Emre might have been involved. Rug merchant's body found floating in Bosphorus. Oh, Mehmet is dead. That guy? Mehmet's been killed now, too. His body was found. Oh, wow. So now Emre has been killed and his uncle has been killed too. Oh, that sucks. Wait, I'm a, what did it say? The younger Bahi's body was discovered by an American journalist. The American who has been named as a suspect is not yet in custody. So we've been framed. We're a, we're a suspect in Matt's death. This have a pretty cool story for an educational game. Murder, too. For an EDU game. Pretty, uh... Intrigue. Some intrigue. Thriller. So, I think we have to go back to the book bazaar. Since we got another note. Yeah, he's gonna stop playing other games soon. He's gonna go back to Road Rash only. After the sixth hour, you start to melt. Six hours is a pretty good stream. I think you get used to it. I don't know how long you've been streaming for. How long have you been streaming for? I think for me, I got used to doing it longer. I also like eat something in the middle of the stream because that helps me keep energy. Uh, got to have a comfortable chair, good chair, good setup. Make sure you take breaks. But I think it is something that you you, you get used to doing longer over time. This guy's here. This guy? 
No? Um, I'm supposed to walk over. Walk over here? Do we need to go here? Gotta show him my press pass. Ah, member of the press corps doing a story on the Grand Bazaar? <laughs> this is gonna be good. Follow someone that does 13 hours. Yeah, I, I, I think I get tired. Like, I don't know. I couldn't constantly do 13 hours either. Maybe if I didn't have any other responsibilities. No, it's doing a smart story on smuggling. Hasn't there been enough negative press about that in this part of the world? You admit this country has a problem with smuggling. That depends on how you define smuggling. Even the courts can't decide what country owns what artifact. Hey, CS255. No, it's not like Carmen San Diego. You believe antiquity should be turned to their country of origin? Of course I do. That's how I make my living. Okay, he returns. The curator at the museum was talking to you about Turkish artifacts. Do you work with museums a lot? I've worked in this country most of my life. I'm Jeremy Carpenter. Okay. This is just a guy basically reading with no uh, no emotion at all. I heard you worked at Top Copy Palace on the Restoration. Have you ever worked at the Cistern Basilica? An engineering firm got a grant to do some structural work. They called me in to translate the original documents from the Latin. Look, why are you interviewing me for a story on smuggling? People may not always agree on which pieces I should sell, but I've never done anything that could be considered illegal. I think you'd better find another source. Hmm. 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 Okay. Okay, no emotion, actor man. Let's leave. Back to the museum. You stream 10 hours barefoot uphill? Wow, that's insane. Back to the museum? Find another source. Maybe the museum director. One year, used to stream more because you have a job. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no. It's hard to stream and also have full-time work if you have responsibility. We don't have anything else to do. It's probably a lot easier. Diapers help. Yeah, <laughs> pee bucket. <laughs> Hi, Jeremy Carpenter. Hey, Ave. Wow, that, that's the, that, that's maybe the worst FMV actor ever. <laughs> or at least the least emotion. Still working on your article? How can I help? Has anyone tried to sell the museum a gold bust of Alexander? That's what we just found in the VR sim. No. I would be interested if that's what you are asking. What do you know about an ancient temple connected with Ephesus? Do you mean the Temple of Artemis? It was one of the seven wonders of the ancient world. The site is known, but the temple was destroyed centuries ago. Oh, nuts. Have there any been any recent excavations at Ephesus? Hmm? Not since the first part of the century. This, this, the mustache is great, though. That's probably why he got hired. <laughs> yeah, if we when we hit uh, our when we hit our our goals, I'm, I'll grow a big handlebar mustache. When we hit our secret goals. Any connection between Alexander the Great and Temple of Artemis? Alexander thought so. The temple belonged to Artemis, the goddess of love and fertility. It burned to the ground on the night Alexander was born, when he conquered Ephesus. One of the first thing he did was to restore her temple. Have there been any recent excavations at the Temple of Artemis? <laughs> mm, yes, we approved one, just recently. They were able to confirm several theories about the building materials, but... There wasn't enough money to do any reconstruction. I think I think here's what the problem with this game is. No one who you no one who you talk to has any emotion in their voice. So it's hard to get emotionally invested. I think at the beginning, like the the cop the police officer, he's got emotion. He's got at least some emotion. Um the bookseller has a little bit less, and then everyone else is just completely dead inside. Hey Luna. What's up, Lucifer? Who approves archaeological restorations? Can I see the file? You're the second person today to request access to these files. What? A young woman from the university computer lab asked for a copy. She also wanted the files on Topkapı, Hagia Sophia, and the Basilica Cistern. What exactly are you looking for? I, I think there's a connection between the smuggling. That's impossible. 
How do you know? Every artifact is documented the moment it is uncovered. Maybe there's something a mistake. The archaeology teams must account for every item they dig up. Yeah, but maybe someone, maybe there is a, how do you know, hey Otter? You learned a lot of this of the past couple of days. I literally only played this one, you're talking, you including today? I'm glad you're learning. <laughs> yeah, Jeremy Carpenter captured the feeling of I don't care. Why are you bugging me? Maybe that was his emotion. He doesn't care at all. Hey, Summers, she cute? No, but. I didn't. Her suit doesn't seem to fit, John. But it, you know, it's her style. If she likes this style, then let her wear it. Everything's run by robots, right? Everyone has no emotion. Who approves the restoration project? A committee. Good. We consult on the validity of the proposal. Great. Is there one person or one group that took part in each of these projects? They are totally different. Different periods, different agendas. No, there is no. Wait, there is a small connection, but it's not scholarly. Each of these three groups no. worked with an engineering firm that the committee recommended. Gordon Construction, no. 28 Chilik Street. No, there's no. Wait. <laughs> wait, wait, there is. <laughs> Thanks, Gordian Construction. We're beating this game, I don't care. I'll torture myself. I'm torturing myself. I'm torturing you and us. Me, us. I'm torturing us. We're finishing this game. We're gonna find out the mystery of this smuggling. We're getting the ending to this game. Because the ending to this game will probably be... completely unrewarding. Alright, Gordian Construction. Is that where we go next? Yeah, alright, Gordian Construction. You would conquer Constantinople with her, if you know what I'm saying? I know what you're saying. I think I know what you're... I, I think... I mean, maybe... I have a couple ideas. I have a few ideas. Oh yeah, and then the no 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 nachos guy. No 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 nachos. <laughs> oh, little kids. And the kid, yeah, the most emotion in this game was a <laughs> was a guy telling you not to take shoes that aren't yours. That was the most emotion we've seen from the actors. But it's in a really cool setting. It has a really cool basic idea, concept. Very cool basic ideas. How do I know? Am I supposed to put in, um... Three, four, six? It's five, five numbers. Oh, I guess we can't do anything here. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, here we go. Is this where I'm supposed to go? That's locked too. Wow. Why are you hiring these? This is a shady part of town. Hey, Tris. <laughs> Whatever amount they paid was too much. Not into me? Oh. <laughs> just look. Yeah, don't criticize her medium suit. Alright, she likes wearing mediums just like me. I like her. Dunk a dunk a dunk a dunk a dunk. Okay, uh, what on? This is a bad part of town. Who <laughs> stole my, who stole my dad's suit? <laughs> I go this way. Oh, this is gong go to gong 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 go to gong gong. Oh, now we're back at the bar. Takes us back to the bar. He's, this guy is still smoking and watching people play backgammon. Anybody want to play backgammon and smoke on some pukas later? Anybody? Steel reserve? Steel reserve. I got a steel reserve. Thank you, Luna. Thanks for handing it to me. Hope you're doing well. A lesser man would give enough. You're goddamn right. I am not a lesser. I'm a morer. I'm a lot morer than others. Never give up. Oh, someone was just playing uh, Oki. Someone was just playing some Oki. This guy's still here too. 
Ooh, now we can go in the back. Oh, we might die. Let's save. Die. 21. Bar. Yeah, two, two, well, before this, the first Google Maps game was called Capri uh, Summers, if you've never seen the game Capri, and Capri 2, Anna Capri, and Capri 3, I forget what that one was called. That was the first Google Maps games, I think. When was Capri made? When was the first Capri game made? Capri, A Quiet Weekend in Capri. 2004. Never mind. This is pre Capri. Soccer. Soccer, guys. Soccer. Po Ooh, coffee. Card. A credit card machine. Oh, a gambling card machine. International Airport. Oh, is this, is this falsifying documents? Something like that? Oh. What? Do I need to put something in here? Are we falsifying documents here? What are we doing here? What is this doing? Anyone know what this is? It looks like it's for falsifying documents. Which I would never do. So I'm not an illegal. I'm not an illegal doer. I don't do illegals. I only do legals. Uh oh. We're dead. Ah! Oh, wow. <laughs> that was maybe the best death in the game so far. <laughs> he wasn't even, I think, did, what, did he throw something at me? Or, or, or was that supposed to be getting stabbed again? <laughs> Not in the bar, Adam. Not in the bar. How do you play back, Adam? You just throw discs out, and I think if they land on the arrows, you get a point. Scopa is the official game of the channel. We just thought I've only played it once, Need Polygons. But it became the official game that day. Hey, Nomus, Banana. Banana. Oh, what if this game has an Al Martino like cameo? That'd be epic, Triss. Hey, Macass. Alright, you'll smoke and play back at it? Let's do it. Let's do it. Capri was incredible. Capri 2 was the best. Capri 1 was okay. 2 was amazing. 3 was a fair ending to the. It was a fair. Three, three was like a an epilogue. It was like an epilogue. What was that? <laughs> I don't know if he stabbed me or threw something at me. No, I think we just got killed. Oh, that took me back outside. Oh, that. Okay, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> you see his face? Um, the vods. I think the Capri One vod is on YouTube. I think Capri Two. I don't know if I've. If that's up there. I think Capri 2 is on YouTube also. 3, I'm not sure. Can't beat it on moral grounds. I won't falsify. I can't beat this game. Right. On moral grounds. I will not falsify a document. No. I refuse. Okay, here we go. This is what we needed. Got some pipes back here. Global Air, Notice of Baggage Liability Limitations. Liability for loss, delay, or damage to baggage is limited as follows unless a higher value is declared in advance and additional charges are paid. 1. For most international travel, including domestic portions of international journeys, to approximately $9.07 per pound, $20 per kilo, for checked baggage, and $400 per passenger for unchecked baggage. For travel wholly between U.S. points to $1,250 per passenger on most carriers, a few of lower limits. Excess valuation may not be declared on certain types of valuable articles. Carriers assume no liability for fragile or perishable articles. Passenger chicken and baggage check. Passenger chicken and baggage check. Eggplant, black numbers, apple, red, lime, green. Oh, we've seen this before. There was uh, the rubbing. Eggplant, black, apple, red, lime, green. There was... um. Yeah, this is something to do with gambling. We got it. We, there was another clue about that before. The guy's in there. Gonna kill us. So do we have to, um... I think we've got to take this, put it in here. Oh, we got caught right away. Oh, I think he's throwing something at me? <laughs> he's throwing a dagger at me, and he's very mad. So I just have to go faster. Stop screwing around. 
Yeah, that is a clip of Al Martino from Capri 2, the best game of all time. Let's go faster. Take this and take that. Over to the machine. Or either that or I have to lock the door. Let's see if it if I die right away. This in, put this in. Okay. Let's get out. Alright, so now we got a baggage check. Um This is a baggage it's a ticket and a check. Passport number. Did I need to do anything else? I don't know. What this is for. Okay. Uh, I had a passport number. I don't know. Go on the front door of the bar? This takes me back to the bar. Not in the bar. Should I save? Oh, this guy's back here. Okay, so I think we did everything we need to do because this guy's back here now. Okay, so that's good to know. It's a great death. Ah, the rose day. <laughs> hey, hey, millennial Oscuro. Hey, good morning. <laughs> I like that death. This game has the best deaths. It definitely does have some good deaths. Right, so on Mehmet's notebook, we uncovered the words that was like... Friday, eggplant, Tuesday, oranges. Friday Eggplant Tuesday Oranges. Not in the bar. Gmail, thank you for the 200 bits. Not in the bar. Friday Eggplant Tuesday Oranges. Eggplant black numbers. Apple red lime green. Does that mean I need to actually do something with this now? No. Friday Eggplant Tuesday Oranges. I'm not sure. Rumikubi. This. Maybe it's this? Do I need to play this? You need to do something with the numbers. So it's something about day of the week. Um, okay. Okay, I'm not sure. Go back to the... Bizarre. Didn't know about this game. Is it Mist-like? It's a first-person adventure game, yeah. It's not really like Mist, though. It's more of a... It's kind of an educational game. Partially based off history, but with like a murder mystery um, tied in and like some sci-fi VR kind of thing happening, too. Let's so see, we're supposed to go back to the Bazaar. Go to the Trinket Salesman. Wasn't that the book bazaar? Not here. The book bazaar. It's uh, it's alright. Thanks, Gmail, for the 200. Thank you. Go back to the book bazaar. And then show... Talk to this guy. And show him what? This? Show him this? What am I supposed to show him? The burned paper. Oh, I didn't get a burned paper. Where's the burned paper? Supposed to get some burned paper. What burned paper? I don't have burned paper. So we get the um, claims ticket and the burned paper. This. This is the half burned paper, right? This? We're supposed to show it to him? Hmm. I don't know. I'm not sure how you're supposed to figure this out. Let's go back to Gordian Construction. I think I'm just going to randomly guess. We got to get into Gordian Construction. So I think I'm just going to randomly guess. What rely on the the. Um, let's see, I'm feeling a seven. <laughs> yeah. Seven. Feeling a seven here. Okay. Zero, four, 
Somebody oh, let got it. Dog take a big a poo -poo. Bitten, Bitterman. Thank you for the three gift subs. Thank you so much, Bitterman. I appreciate that very much. Right as we solved a puzzle, too. Thanks, Bitterman. Thank you very, very much. I appreciate that. Thank you. Solved it. Get right in there. Right, I was. I thought that's what it might be. All right, let's explore the construction office. Do -do 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 -do. I knew that's what it. Oh, it's nice. It's nice in here. Well, this is a weird. The, the this the architecture. Okay, we've got. Okay. Got a little. Is that a decoration or a game? Weird. What's that supposed to be? You like throw things in there. You you move them all around. Like a, a tinkering, you tinker. Thanks, Bitterman. Perfect time. Perfect timing. Thank you very much. All right, now we've got some more papers and Herodotus Foundation, Herodotus Foundation, Herodotus Foundation from Shiz Genovese, Herodotus Foundation. Million received from Herodotus Foundation. So this guy worked for Herodotus Foundation. Herodotus Foundation. Uh, Herodotus Foundation for Cultural Preservation, Istanbul Natural Bank, 135 million mortgage payment for 20 Selik Street. We can no longer accept checks from this or any third party without formal clearance from yourself or other officers of Gordian. We can't, they can't accept. This attached check is remitted to you, although in past we frequently accepted checks from Herodotus. We can no longer accept checks without clearance from you or other officers of Gordian. Okay. Banks not accepting checks. Herodotus Foundation for Cultural Preservation. All access and courtesy shall be granted to Gordian Construction for scaffolding, erection, and maintenance in connection with the Hagia Sophia Dome renovation. Okay, that's new. Oh, hold on. Take those away. Put those away. For and also for Basilica Cistern seismic retrofitting, Temple of Artemis Foundation excavation, and top copy, earth removal and disposal. So this Gordian construction got into all these places and, and was taking artifacts. So there's something else in Hagia Sophia we haven't seen yet. That's what this is saying. That's what we learned. That's what's going on. Gordian is is finding the secret artifacts and taking them. Enjoy Boston Sea Starks and Maritime. Enjoy those subs. Your life is about to be improved by a fold of a thousand. A thousand fold. Oh, you put your keys in there? Hey, Sevilla. How does my office look? It's fine. It's pretty good. I don't I don't like to be too messy. Every once in a while, like some envelopes pile up. Like if there's like something I have to remember to do. Like, uh, I'll put like uh, in from like, I get mailed some envelopes pile up, but I, I don't, I don't get too messy. Savio, what are you unfolded laundry? Well, yeah, there still is some of that. I haven't done all the laundry yet. I gotta, I gotta get rid of clothes and whatnot. Here's another, oh, uh, don't sit on that. It's just, uh, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Don't sit on that. Jeez, that would be you. That'd be a disaster. What do we got here? Oh, don't sit on that. Ay, ay, ay. You know what I mean? That would hurt too, though, if you sat on that. Don't sit on this or that. Okay, well, we... What did I just do? What happened? Where'd the game go? <laughs> Damn it. I think I just saved it. <laughs> we lost the game. Hey, Zetsu, don't sit on that. My office is extremely official. It's decent. Yeah, I like keep it decent, but it, I'm not going to pretend like it's super clean or anything. I do it, Zetso. It was easy to steal artifacts because they just acted bored. <laughs> That's what the no emotion scam is. This is how we do it. Windows was not properly shut down. Building plans, glass dish, some drawers. Some drawers we gotta look in. Discovery Channel. Discover the world. I think we're getting there. We're definitely going to finish this game today. We might even have time to play something else, too. We're getting there. Let's finish this mystery. 
Alright, when did I last save? In front of this door? It's clean. Okay, we save. Okay. That was a good save. Made a good save. I'm um, alright. This game's... We're gonna beat this today. Zetsubera, thank you for asking. We got... we Somebody... Oh, here. There's drawers down here. We got... Uh, somebody threw a knife at us when he was... And re he was really, really mad and he threw a knife at us. That happened. There's a drawer here. <gasps> oh, what's up? up? Flan, thank you for the sub. I appreciate that, Flan. Thank you very much. 60... Big stinky months. Thank you. Yadis, soccer. Yadis. You might be able to die in here. Let's take the docks. Um, where were those docks? Here. Take the docks. And save again. 2022 20, office. Yeah, thanks, Nate, Nate, for reminding about that god giveaway. But a bit a bit thanks for share thanks for the host uh Zetso Biro Zetso Biro thank you So we get those docks and then leave What do we do we do do I'm just supposed to leave do 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 Oh I went back in there need to leave 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 got to leave coffee mukbang that would be fun trying different coffees all day long Okay, back to the hotel. De Londres. De Londres. Am I liking the game? It's okay. I think everything is good other than, like, it's got some basic design flaws. But, um... It has some basic design flaws, but the basics of the game are pretty solid. Ah, so glad you could come. Make yourself at home, please. Okay. Um, okay, make myself at home. I'm gonna take a big shit on the desk. Alright, I'm gonna climb in here. I'm gonna throw, what am I supposed to do in here? Am I supposed to throw stuff in here? Like hide in here? Scan this? Probably supposed to show him the documents. He's like the big f uh, thunder guy. But this is remarkable. Guardian construction is the only common link at all the sites. Yeah. It appears that Herodotus Foundation owns Guardian construction. Mm -hmm. They've been manipulating all the thefts on the start. No. Yeah. yeah, I figured that out too. Guardian construction's doing all the thefts. How did they get to the antiquities? The construction company would be the first on site. Mm -hmm. They would do all the setups for the academics if they knew exactly what they should be looking for. Oh. What's Herodotus? Herodotus is a very prestigious foundation. They work very closely with the Approvals Committee for Historical Restoration. They approve the proposals for the projects and hire the contractors. Okay. How's Herodotus linked to Cleo? This is the most troubling part. I cannot believe I've been such a fool. But who else could have twisted all my intentions? Who has such an access? The simulations? The fundings, the academic credentials. Ah, Sharife. This must be stopped. Huh? Immediately, go to the police. Give them this proof. Tell them exactly what you told me. Go. What? Sharif, the person who... That's the, that's the lady who was making the VR. No way, it can't be her. Why don't you help me? I gotta go to the police? I don't know how to go to the police. Where I don't know where they are, the police. Thanks, Beard, for making me look buff in chat. That dude's a voice actor for Red Alert? Really? Did the, is the police on here? I don't know where the police are. Where are the police? They're at the museum. Great. <laughs> oh, right. The police are always at this museum for some reason. Yeah, I found this on the street. It's in a bag, though. Good eat. We good? And the police are always at the museum. I wonder why. Where are they? Here's the police. What's up, police? Not now. Not unless you've got something new. 
I got these docks, bro. Check out these docks. You're gonna love it. This is your proof. Herodotus just reported these supposed. They didn't understand why someone would steal the foundation's blank port. Uh oh. Now it makes sense. You're under arrest. Discussion. Ah. <laughs> we lost. We died. We got framed. They said they stole blank forms, and I filled them out. And then a man walked up to us, very close. So we're not supposed to go to the police. Where do we go? We gotta try to find Sharif. I wonder if this guy's in on it too. This guy here. Go to the tower. Puzz is afoot. No oh, crime museum. Hey GJ. Had a dota as a base hunter song. Okay, here we go. Here's. Why are you haunting me? I have nothing to talk to you about. Leave me alone. Nothing. Check out these docks I found. You realize what this means? The end of my career. Wait, she killed Emre? Why'd you have to kill Emre? What are you talking about? I may be a fool, but I'm no killer. Don't you understand what's been going on? Iskandar owns the Herodotus Foundation. You're a journalist, see for yourself. My cam off the whole time? I have no idea what's going on right now. Oh, so Iskander's the dude who's behind all this. Iskander believes you're behind the thefts. Of course he would have told you that. Iskander has been manipulating all of us from the start. I should have realized that Iskander was all behind this when I saw the Temple of Artemis. He asked me to build it, but I didn't. Your friend Emre was very bright. Oh, I knew it was that bald Iskander guy. Iskander used the simulations to find artifacts. Through Herodotus, he made sure the right projects got approvals. And each of those projects used Gordians. I knew it. He keeps it. his personal files on the foundation took his arrest, at the university. He is so meticulous. I know that if we can get into that, we will find all the proof we need. Yeah, it was the bald guy the whole time. Yo, John Drill. This has the most emotionless FMV, no I think. No security lockout. It's not like him. Out of any game I've oh, ever played. A copy of my first simulation. Let's see what you found there. Okay, I'm going in. It's a cool VR headset. Yo, Toast. Toasty, we're going in. VR, you ready? Now, if you're not ready, get ready, because we're going in. The final VR. Aya Sophia. Sam. Prototype simulation. Warning, conflicting time parameters, site matrix unstable. Uh-oh, unstable. It's unstable in here. Where's Poirot? Probably in France, where he's from. Ne um, Ave, probably in France. Hey, that juice. Boom, do, 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 do. What's up, Nine Skull? What's up, FNA? Yeah, let's do this. Lawnmower Man. Yeah, this is James like, more as exciting as Lawnmower Man. Do, 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 do. Don't worry, I'm gonna keep loading to a minimum. All right, we'll look around for items. We just got a helmet. We got a helmet, that's pretty cool. We can go to the north or we can go into the here. Let's try going upstairs. I think this is upstairs. Discover the mystery. Apparently you can also go to the museum and show the documents to some dude there. Okay, whatever. Okay, I think this is like the last part of the game. So let's try to figure it out. This is the last uh, section of the game. Let's figure it out with pure uh, puzz skill. Stop spinning. Figure this part out with pure puzz skill. We'll look up and down, look all around. We got a genie magic lamp. Did I ever play Lawnmower Man? Uh, there's a bunch of them. I played the DOS one, which is a bunch of mini games. 
and um, I didn't finish it because you only have so many lives, so you have to get to a certain. You have to finish it on only a certain amount of lives for like eight different mini games, and if you lose, you have to go all the way back to the beginning. So I never finished it, but I did try it. I would give it another shot. It's like a bunch of puzzle and platforming games that you can't fail in. Yeah, in the Matrix. Poirot's Belgian? You don't say. Hmm, I thought he was French, because he's always speaking French all the time, dog IRL. I'm gonna explode. Yeah, I like how the game breaks when you're trying to save, too. I enjoy that, too, King. Uh, where I came in, that's where I came in, right? Okay, I'm just trying to find all the ways I can go. Is this where I came in? Game almost craps itself a lot. Are we gonna have to build enough? At that moment, when the Turks broke into the Church of Sancta Sophia, a Greek bishop was saying mass. Oops. Okay, <laughs> I actually kind of wanted to listen to that, but then I clicked on these flowers, and then it just ended. Okay, a Greek bishop was saying mass. Wait, no, that was the end of it. He wasn't saying. He didn't say anything else. That was the end of that educational part. So when the Turks broke in, a Greek bishop was saying mass. That's awesome. Okay, which which lawnmower game did you mean, Luna? There's also like a platformer on SNES and Genesis, I think. They speak French in Belgium. That's not true. Then why don't they call them French waffles instead of Bel Belgium waffles, Dog IRL? That doesn't make any sense at all. Damn it, I'm going back upstairs. I didn't mean to do that. Belgian, Belgian. I'm starting to forget, but getting confused. Hey, do I go th go through here? Yeah, into the vestibule. There we go, back into the hallway. They speak Belginium. <laughs> I like Belginium is my favorite metal. Isn't Wolverine's claws made out of Belginian? Belginium. King Glory to God, who has deemed me worthy of fulfilling such a work. That's where we came oh, in. Oh, Solomon, I have surpassed thee. Here we go. Ooh, a hole. Okay, this wasn't in the actual Hagia Sophia. We're, lo there's an we're looking for another artifact in here. So Herodotus was... I guess using these sims to find secret artifacts. And that, that's why the guy was funding this lady's research, so they could find a secret artifacts and steal them. Okay, there's a jail down here, but it's not, not complete. Let's look at these objects. We got... Anatonia, wife of Belisarius. Is this flowers or something? Kingdom of Belgium has three official languages. Dutch, French, and German. Anethemus, architect of Anna Sophia. Procopius, Byzantine court historian. These objects represent these people. Uh, Belisarius, general to Justinian. Hey, Doom Bacon, I'm fine. How are you? I can't complain. No, who'd listen if I did, you know? It was weird because it didn't let me. It didn't even say like simulation not complete. It just normally when you see that in the VR sim, you have to. Their army, compounded of so many nations, something. customs, and languages, spent three days in sacking the. You have to scan them uh, in. You have to scan something in in the real world, but it didn't even say that. So I guess we don't do that this time. I can go over there. This is very hard to navigate to find all the way paths you can go. This is horrifying. This is a nightmare. Go back there. Okay, there's, we're gonna miss an object again. 
There's, there's, this game this game maybe does absolutely everything despite having like a cool basic premise and a decent design it does everything that I hate that adventure games do it also makes you wander around giant areas that are confusing to find all the different paths and because you have to find random objects just placed around the ground that's another thing I hate when adventure games do <laughs> As for the great church. And another thing. As for the great. This game doesn't deserve for us to listen to it anymore. Then we're just wandering around finding these objects. Tommy Dangerfield. Why did you yell? Christopher, I need to take out Tommy Dangerfield. Yeah, he's an ex capo. He's been uh, getting something under a uh, take under the table. Get an extra take under the table. When the Sultan came to the great church, he dismounted, entered it, and stood marveling at the sight, finding one of the... Finding one of the what? Wow, we'll never know. We will never, ever know. Do I put all these things? I have a feeling you put all these things, all these, uh, like, all this represents... Here, yeah. Okay, you have to... Let us pray to the Lord that he might send his protecting angels to guard this task and its workers. All right, let's do it. Lord, whose wish we fulfill in building this church, we dedicate this temple to you. And then... Sick. Lord, you who are the cornerstone and unbreak... Protect us from the traps of the enemy, both visible and invisible, in the name of the most pure, blessed, and glorious queen, the mother of God. Cool. So we have to find a bunch of objects and put them on this thing. We might not have the, any of the other objects we need. Poor Rudd is in French. He's Belgian. He's Belgian. He's Belgian. He's Belgian. He's Belgian. You gotta hang out with some buds online. Nice. What'd you do? Doing bacon. Let me guess. Play. Uh, let me guess. Um, hmm. You played Worms Armageddon. Okay, so we just have to place them. But it didn't let me place any of these unless I couldn't find the hotspots. So I must have to find more objects. It's like the most... Oh, that took me back into this. Most horrifying kind of puzzle. So hard to know where I can go. Okay. I don't think I've been here. There must be an object here somewhere. Nothing. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay, nothing. 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 Nothing over here. There's nothing over here at all. Just a... Just a pointless. A, just a pointless. I can't even go back. Okay, I can go back. Nope, mom doesn't come tell me to clean up my toys. I don't feel like cleaning up. I feel like cleaning up my toys. Uh, was there anything over here? What? Was there another way to go? Is there another item? Is this like the final puzzle? And then we catch them in the act or something like that? Like we find the artifact while they're on the way? Or do I do I go in here? What's... There's nothing... I wonder if you put all the objects, then it unlocks this. Unlocks this down here. Maybe I just didn't find the correct hotspots. Let me go back to this. Worms Armageddon is good. You know, I've never really played a Worms game. Maybe once. That would be fun to play. That's, that's a lot of different players, right? You can have a lot of different people at once. Like 8 or 16. That'd be fun to get together a game of that. Some worms. What's the best worms? You don't place. You can't place these. So, uh, maybe you have to do it in a specific order. And but they don't come off when you leave, which means that they're probably right. You can now. You can go. Okay, that's the same as this. Um, okay, I I don't know if I've missed anything. You watched a virtual YouTuber sing. Karo the heathen Karoke. infidels entered Sancta Sophia, Karoke. the wonderful shrine of the holy wisdom. Hmm. Did we miss anything? Is there anything upstairs? Um, do we want to wander through here randomly or just or figure out if we have all the items or not? 
Uh, the urn. We got the urn. I guess we just wander around and try to figure it out. Try to look around for it. Try not to look it up. Is there any? Just try to find the different paths. Dismembering toys, kind of kid. <laughs> A lot of my toys have strange, strangely have missing limbs. A lot of channels on my Discord. Where's the place to post memes? You can put whatever you want in main chat. I don't really. I don't really have like a meme chat. Memes are... I don't understand memes. What's a meme? Like, what do you mean meme? Like a funny picture? Like, wherever you want. Just main chat, maybe. Do I need... Do I need to have a meme channel? For a meme? Is a meme... You mean like a picture? <laughs> What's a meme? A meme is a joke? You can put it in main chat, I guess. I don't... I guess I don't really have a meme... Um, channel. I really have a meme channel. Meant for memes. You were meant for memes. And I was meant for you. <laughs> okay. What is, he's not gonna give up. Not gonna give up. I'm not gonna give up. I'm not gonna give up. Kettle, 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 kettle. Worms Armageddon was your favorite, Wooch. That's online multiplayer's rep. Worms. M Worms MD holds true to the classic and has modern networking. All right, Worms MD sounds like the one. Wait, is this an item? Something on this bench? No. Uh, is that another nothing on the bench? This is where I. That's where I came into there. This is how you go. Oh, that take me back there. Here, there. Here, there. Hair there. Got no hair there. Okay, you go back here. We go through the black door. Then we go through this hall door. Let me go through these hall. Main chat. Main chat. Main chat. Main chat sound good. Okay, this. Wait. Yeah, this. Go here. We go here. And now we're looking for... We're looking for more objects. We're looking for... Hold on. You can go here. Is this the same as... Is this the same as this? You don't know. Yeah, it is. Sometimes you just don't know. All right, we're getting dangerously close to just looking up where these objects are that we need. Dangerously close, so be ready. All right, we're there. All right, we need we need a purple urn. We saw the barred space. We need a purple urn. We need an orb. We got that. We got a chalice. We got that. We need the helmet. We got that. And we need a lantern. We got that. Get a lantern. Second floor, we need a red compass. On the second floor. This is the second floor. Pick up the compass. Then pick up the flower in the middle. Okay, so we... We didn't get a compass from back here. Is Worms MD Cannon? Yeah, is Worms MD Cannon? Is it Cannon for the story? There's a red compass somewhere? Here? Red compass, red compass. There's supposed to be a red compass here. Go to left until you see a red compass. Red compass. Red, red compass. There's supposed to be a red compass. Yeah, there's supposed to be a red compass. Do you guys, did I get it? Did I get the compass too? I don't think I did. Red, red compass. Ugh, sorry for spinning. Maybe it's back through here. No, that's now we're back. Red compass. I don't see red. Maybe is the red compass here? On the wall? Up here? In the wall? On the floor? Did I already get the compass? No, I already got the compass. I already got the compass. I remember that the compass is different. Right, that pointy thing. We already got the compass. Alright, so we have to go back into here and go to the floor. I think we're done. There's a cannon. Okay, there's a cannon. Good. A little pixel hunt inside virtual reality and start inside of a game. This is insane what's going on right now, IIV. This is the most exciting. Yeah, I've played Mummy and Frankenstein. Those games are amazing, King. We've played those. I'll, I might play them again this year. Might play them again. Okay. Alright, so if we place this, 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 
Just have to find the right hot spot. To, we have to place these, right? Or maybe you... Have you placed these items somewhere else? I don't really know how to place them. We have to mimic the coronation ceremony. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Go to the coronation circle. Oh. Oh. Oh, we have to go up on the balcony. Chalice, helmet, compass. Okay. We gotta go back. We gotta go up on the balcony. Am I enjoying it? Uh, I don't know. Red. Yeah, we did have the compass. Got them ten bucks from Walmart. Those are really good games to get. Those are those are good games. Those are good games. Plus they have Malcolm McDowell and Tim Curry. Like those are actually really good games. And uh, they're interesting too. They have good puzzles. We're supposed to go through here. Backseat traps. <laughs> We're supposed to put this uh, up on the balcony. Or where? Uh, go to the main... Go place the purple urn on the Empress's Amphalos. Oh, here. How peaceful are your habitations, O Lord of Hosts. My soul is exhausted, sighing at the portal of the Lord. Simulation incomplete. Insufficient data. I think I did it in the wrong order. You have to do it in the correct order. Red, red wine. Most of the games I play have a bad guy looking over a cityscape. <laughs> On the art. Apparently. Apparently, yeah. Fish guts, yeah. Oh, I lost an uncle to back seating. It happened. Told him what to do, and then he just gave up. Didn't want to play anymore. Went insane. You gotta do it in the right order. I know the order off the top of my head. I know the order. It's very it's a very easy order to remember because I remember reading it from the thing before. The forder. The order. I know. Hey Lord Manny. Okay, I remember the order. It's first we want to place the chalice here. Let us pray to the and Lord then we that he might the send helmet. his protector. Here. Protect us from the traps of the enemy, the both visible compass. and invisible, in the name of the most pure. Here. Lord, and then we want to place. The stone and then path. we go back up. I, I mean, this is very obvious to most people. Then you want to. Mm hmm. Then we want to go back up there and put the princess thing. Mm -hmm. We got to do the ceremony the right way. Obviously. Obviously. Did I beat Equal Quest 2? Yeah, we beat that. It was about six hours. Six hour game. And we played this educational game. I just want to help kids learn, and adults. I want to help people learn with the stream, you know? How peaceful are your habits? And put that up there. I want to help people learn, and I hope people learned by playing this game. I hope people learned something about it. I learned. This game forced me to learn. How's this game? It's all right. It's all right. Um, I don't really recommend it, to be honest. <laughs> it's not, I say it's not very good as a game. It has a good concept, but it's not executed very well, in my opinion. Let me save here. It's actually executed pretty damn poorly. I would say it's a really good concept that is executed very poorly. Uh, end one. Yeah, good concept executed poorly. Maybe if you really, really, really like games, you got nothing else to play, and you just like trying everything, kind of like me, then maybe try it. Or, Lord, whose wish we fulfill in building this church, we dedicate this temple to you in the name of your holy wisdom. Other people tend to like it, though. Extrapolating, 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 extrapo. Oh! Right, that thing. Sight extrapolation complete. The diadem trigger charm trigger ac accessing internet link. Initiating emergency police response. Police. Countdown to total system failure. Initiating system failure. Warning. Base sight matrix may be lost. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, the diadem's in here. 
site matrix may be lost? Should I jack out of here? Or do we need to... Okay, maybe I need to go down the sewer. Collapse imminent. Maybe we go down... Simulation. Extending system parameters Don't to exit. Hard drive. Did we go in the um, prison cell? Go down into the cell. We made it into the cell. Okay. So we got the diadem. The diadem is tied into the main story. Exiting simulation. No, don't exit. Extending system parameters to don't exit. Hard drive. Destroy the diadem. Stop Voldemort. Oh, we'll see. Is this a maze? Warning. System unstable. Stable system. This is this appears to be a maze. Let's try to get it with brain power, no writing things down. Let's see what happens when you fail. You probably fail. Data collapse imminent. Collapse of data imminent. You die in the game, you die in real life. Let's die in the game. Oh, we found this. Okay. We found a room. And three. System destabilizing. I'm not an arc. Can we use this here. The diadem of Constantine. Okay, the liturgical fam of Empress Theodora. The gold bust. The and the ruby ring of Suleiman. Those are all the artifacts we found in the simulations. Until total system failure. Herodotus, not Lesovich correspondence Cleo. I don't really know. Fundraising. What? 40 seconds <laughs> until total system failure. Uh Internet is freaking out. I can't do anything with this. I can't back up. I'm stuck. Can't take failure. it. I can't actually do anything. I clicked fundraising. I clicked Herodotus fundraising. 20 seconds until total system <laughs> failure. This sound from uh Like he wants to be a millionaire. I can't click anything. Ten seconds until Recycle? System failed. Nine, eight, seven. Access terminated. Link interrupted at source. All right, let's see what happens if you fail. <laughs> That's a cool ending. Emergency shutdown initiated. Any prince on a heavy diadem? It's good. You look no, good. No, this is a mistake. No mistake. You are under arrest. <laughs> See, like, there's cool stuff in the game, but uh, most of the game, like, the majority of it isn't executed very well at all. How you looking, Guinea Prince? Is it working out? So we go through here. I must... I must have gotten myself stuck. Let me save it here. And four. Lasovich, not. Transactions. Take these and... You, once you click one of these things, export to the- Oh, I missed that. Export to the computer lab. And then to the internet? To the recycle? Deleted. Hiya Sophia. File corrupted. File corrupted. Personal. Export to the computer lab. Recycle. Recycle. Internet. I deleted. I don't know. How am I doing? I don't know why I'm doing this. We're to recycle. Deleted. I have deleted. Okay. This doesn't work very well. Herodotus. Fundraising. Fundraising. Internet. Internet. Computer lab. Recycle. <laughs> Schedule. Recycle. Internet. What do you, it's recycle or export it. Access terminated. Link interrupted at you die in the game. <laughs> you die in the game, die in the game. Let's die in the game, chat. <laughs> no, this is a mistake. No mistake. You are under arrest. Something was wonky about that interface. Something's a little wonky, man. Need the song to play? Help you. Herodotus. Fundraising. Export. Computer lab. Seconds until Maybe you just have to do that. Earlier. Or schedule? Internet? Oh, I see. Or you can delete it. 40 seconds until 
into a total system failure. Click it twice, click it multiple times, many times. Oh, you click in the center. What is not? Not transactions. Oh, I see. You gotta click the outside and then the inside. File transfer terminated at source. Oh, okay. I didn't get. You had to click the. Wait! We have the proof! <laughs> Let's go talk to Mr. Lazovich, shall we? You had to click the, the point and then the ah. center. Confusing. Hey, Vagabond. We got the proof. Wait, we have the proof. <laughs> Ooh, a party. <laughs> ah, this is nice. This is great. Ooh, look at that food. Is that a lobster? Tonight, the Istanbul Historical Alliance acknowledges the efforts of one of Istanbul's most respected citizens, whose selfless work has greatly contributed to the historical the preservation of our city. It is with great pleasure that I present to you the recipient of this year's award for civic responsibility, Iskander Lazovic. This guy's gonna get arrested. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hold on. This touches me deeply. Mine is not an unusual story. I want you to make come you city. Oh. Made me welcome. Hmm. I only managed to give back a small taste of the kindness you have offered me. So, it is with great humility that I accept this award. Thank you. Lazovic! Detective? Where are your manners? <laughs> Excuse <laughs> manners. me. My apologies. I'm arresting you for the theft of Satan. It is wow, right in front of everyone. the murder of everybody. <laughs> so bad for him. With a sad face. Mr. Lazovic also faces charges of conspiracy to commit custody. murder. Also arrested on two counts of first degree <laughs> murder was Italian national Carlo Genovese. <laughs> Police Carlo Genovese was found dead today in his prison cell in Ankara Penal Institution. Where guards and the stolen treasure returned. You returned the stolen treasures. You got arrested for murder. <laughs> <laughs> the only emotion in the whole game is that guy's sad face. <laughs> Should be an emote. <laughs> ah, it made me laugh at the end. It was a pretty cool game. There was a cool concept. Uh, yeah, it had some basic design flaws. Not really... You would have had to wander around all the areas to figure out how to advance it. But it was a it was a cool basic idea for a game, especially for an educational game. It really had a, br a grand uh, concept for an educational game. So Don Daglo worked on this. That name is familiar. The name is very familiar. Don Daglo. He did. He was like an early game programmer or something, right? Early 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 game guy. What's the like Atari and stuff. Worked at Atari or in television. Started at Atari, I think. I don't know. Familiar. Maybe I saw him on G4 a while ago. Yay, it's over. <laughs> Can we do Bizarre Earthquake next? Um, I don't have it, but yeah, we could we could try. I was gonna do Mysteries of the Sith, but I don't know if I feel like playing a shooter. Why does Constantinople get the witch, eh? He's rich, influential. I love that sad face at the end. That was, a, that was very rude, I must say. A rude arrest. Yeah, we did it. We finished it. Sometimes you... You you start an FMV game, and not all FMV games are winners. I remember we played the game um, Santa Fe Chronicles, and I was like, oh, it's going to be a silly FMV game, but it was very much like this, but way worse way more boring and uninteresting and i kind of want to like keep like you kind of want to keep playing it but you're really bored the whole time <laughs> oh, never we did it <laughs> i don't know if anybody remembers santa fe chronicles but that was even less uh, this actually this might be the worst acting i've ever in an fmb game i've ever played do i stick to older games a lot of the times i do vagabond yeah 
obscure stuff, older games. I'm not opposed to the newer games, though. I think I was going to play a newer game, I would play stuff like Quest for Infamy, Order of the Thorn, That those kind of games are the newer adventures I'm into, Vagabond, but I've heard of that game. It's not a shooter. I know, Dave. I thought I, I was saying... Next we could either do like a really bizarre adventure game called Bizarre Earthquake, or we could play Mysteries of the Sith. Or we could play something else, but those are my two. Those are the two top ideas. The Carnival Games one? Um... No. No, that was Panic in the Park. Alright, I mean, it was alright. It was alright. I'm glad we- I'm glad- I'm glad in some ways that we played it. <laughs> or we could play Star Trek 25th Anniversary. You wanna do a poll? Let's do a poll and whatever- Bizarre Earthquake is an extremely hilarious game. Okay, we're gonna do a poll. We're gonna go to the mist car and then do a poll. Next game, because we have plenty of time. 